The scouts came back? One came with nothing? Damn, they're all juiced up. I'm number six. I guess the attack cubes are kind of useless, right? Because you could just pick whoever and uh, and just do the first gym training. I've never played Harvest Moon. I don't even know what kind of game that is. go to the lab for that one. The super drills used to open passageways? Oh, so it's not even used for uh for damage now? Okay, let's go to the lab. Farming, dating, and social sim? Oh man. We're at 500,000 now. Uh, nope. First, let's talk to all of them. Because, you know, sequence. <clears throat> so we got screwed over on the bottles. What is it, number 30? We want to add more tanks to the Gustav. We have to make them lighter somehow. Hmm. Okay. So maybe we have to give it to him. Can't make any bigger balls. You have to use these. Just trying to figure out how to develop new parts. Do you want to hear how? Alright, I'll tell you then. To develop new parts, you need to get the Sir, Sir Bot in charge of the part to realize a special skill. And you need lots of any. Oh yeah, we didn't know this. Wow, isn't this selenium? It's supposed to be the lightest metal known. If we use this, we can make more E-tanks for the Gustav. Okay, now development. E-tank 4. 150! Jesus! These guys are destroying the bank! Oh, the police lights will bring it down a tad. One notch. Yay! Now we got lots of health. Yo, what's up, Gambit? How you feeling, man? Did you enjoy uh, Kakon Cup? It was a doozy. Let's talk to this guy again. We learned how to make E Tank 5. If you can spread this in, I think you should have us build one. E Tank 5, 200,000! I'll never get this stupid hard armor. <sighs> Oops, no. Hmm. Well, if we want to put any more tanks in the goose out, they need to, they need to be smaller. Smaller. Interesting. And we're getting more powerful. Oh man, okay. Mm-hmm. Haven't seen it was working. Yeah, all good. Yeah, let me know when you see it. It's, uh, it's really good. 
Okay, uh, I guess it's training time, boys. Let's get that speed up for number one. Maxed out. Maxed out. Here we go. No! Spaghetti! D lunch! D for days! Screwed up on that one really threw me off. Curry rice. Best way to lose by flipping pancakes on the floor. What the hell is that supposed to mean? <laughs> No one wants spaghetti, dude. There we go. Oh my god. Uh, how about a DDR retro playthrough? Oh, I'm beast at DDR, but the problem is DMCA, right? Because it's on Twitch. Otherwise, I would, of course, we'd be playing DDR a million times by now. I would want to show you guys that crazy, uh, I would love to do that achievement thing and show you guys. Right? Otherwise, we'd be playing Parappa the Rapper and Samba de Amigo, and we'd be playing a ton of shit, guys, if I could play uh, any of those kind of games. I would love to. Yeah, it is what it is, right? Oh, shit. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, Beat Mania. Beat Mania is really hard, man. Like, the actual game is very tough. I used to play a lot of Beat Mania, and I was, like, really bad at it, even though I played it for so long. I was okay at the Drum Mania. Mm -hmm. DMC really isn't an issue now, as Twitch will just mute the crap out of your VODs. Yeah, I mean, if you're a big streamer, it's a little more concerning because, you know, you can get DMCA'd, like, live, right? Or through a clip. And, yeah, Twitch does a precaution by muting your thing, but uh, if it doesn't pick it up, or if you get caught live for whatever reason, it just, to me, it's just not worth the risk. Like, as a big streamer, uh, you know, you have people that can protect you, but as a small streamer, there's no one to protect you. So if you get screwed, no one's going to help you. It's just not a risk I'm willing to take. Spaghetti. 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 
Just so I can play some DDR, you know? It's the same reason why I didn't get screwed over when about that uh, Street Fighter 6 uh, news with those uh, developers playing and I didn't take the bite and a bunch of people got shot. I have to survive. Press the wrong button. Ah, oh, if I didn't screw up, I pressed the wrong button. The curry rice and spaghetti is tricky because uh, they're the both the single button presses, right? So sometimes they get mixed up. They do that shit on purpose too. Is there any way you can restart it? Does it restart the whole thing? So you have to suffer for 36 seconds, hey? That's whack. You gotta suffer for 36 fucking seconds if you screw up. Because you're automatically, once you miss one, you're screwed, basically. It's okay, I'll pop this sand so I can retry it faster. Curry rice. Holy a shit, a lunch for a days. A lunch, let's go. No. Ugh. Just in time. Ah, the too many D's and the B's got me fucked there. The D's and the B's. I, I saw the timer in the corner of my eye. I was 25th of a second almost to lose. I was insane. I was close. And he's like good RNG. <laughs> This song's driving me nuts, dude. I don't even hear the music, bro. All I hear is the commands of these hungry warriors. I'm so in the zone, dude. Oh, 
Oh god, dude. God, this drives me crazy. Oh my god, that's so hard. I was three off. Holy shit. This is not even the last level. There's one after this, and it took me a few hours to even finish the last level. <laughs> yeah. That's actually really interesting. I want to check that out. You have to be like completely cracked. Side quest hell, dude. That's what these games are all about. Side quest hell. It's fucking ridiculous how hard this is. This is way, way too hard for a kid. <sighs> God! Vesper's gonna bust out the T. I don't know about that. Fucking curry spaghetti always tilts me, dude. It's like the game heard me or something there. He's doing it on it's doing it on purpose, man, to tilt me. No! Oh god, man. I had to play it on CRT. <laughs> that sounds like Final Fantasy Nine, man. CRT. <laughs> I don't worry. I'll put on my 240 hertz monitor and we'll go to town on this shit. Dude, you have to go so much faster. 240 hertz monitor is not enough. <laughs> That's fucking faster than CRT, dude. Give me a break. I didn't mean to do that. My, my fingers can't move as fast as my brain. It drives me crazy, dude. Oh, God! 
old arcade. <laughs> oh my god, this tilts the shell in me. Oh, fuck, dude. Oh! Oh, I can't even remember the fucking buttons, dude! Hey, lunch! Dinner! Spaghetti! 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 Hey, lunch! Spaghetti! Spaghetti! Yeah, keep giving me that damn spaghetti! Hey, lunch. Hey, lunch. Give me that damn hey, fucking spaghetti! Hey, lunch! Go rice! Ah, the spaghetti! Spaghetti! Yes, yeah, spaghetti! Give me that damn spaghetti! No! Spaghetti! Yes! Spaghetti! Spaghetti! Yes! Yes! Yes, spaghetti! Yes! Where's spaghetti? No! I fucking pressed the wrong button! No! That was my run, dude! They were giving me spaghetti! 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 Oh, spaghetti! Oh my god! No more curry! God! No more! Yes! Yes! Oh god! Spaghetti! Spaghetti! E! B! E. E. Hurry! C! C! D! Fucking C! Where's my spaghetti? <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> you need such a strong start, man. You need to be cracked! <sighs> they do that on purpose, right? Because you, I, I would think, I think D is down as well. That's why I keep messing it up. They, like, they do this on purpose to really make you like second guess it. I mean, of course, I can change the buttons, but that's a dark path. We want to go down that path. Best way is just to have confidence and don't hesitate and just do it. If I hesitate, it's when I make mistakes. They, the D and C just drive me fucking crazy, bro. And if and I run into a problem too that if you switch the keys too late now or it's in, when I'm in the zone, I'm gonna naturally forget which one I changed it to, right? And then that will screw it up even uh, more. Fuck! No! Dude, I- Those last ones, man, I kept on hesitating, I don't know why. Oh my god. 
Uh, it is said in the unfettered mind that if you focus on your enemy's sword, you'll be captured by his sword. If you focus on his movement, you'll be captured by his movement. And it's only by not thinking of anything can your mind move freely. Man, Jerry players are weird, dude. I don't have to think about that shit when I play Honda. I just charge and do headbutt. Did you just call me a chum, Zach? Run! Oh, fuck! Serenity now, dude. Serenity now. Holy shit. So good. Spaghetti for days. Get in, please. God, I just want to beat this fucking game, dude. Oh my god, why is it so fucking hard? Jeez. Christ. Almost that messed up. What? Oh, damn it. I thought I had that. There's a missing foot. Now I'm just focusing on speed now instead of accuracy. Oh, 
The D's and C's drive me insane, dude. Why is it right D, man? Fuck right D. Fucking Inafune, man. Give me C and D's, dude. The C and D's, man. It's so hard to bounce back now. I'm so tilted. You know, everyone's practicing now for a million dollars. Meanwhile, Vesper is playing this fucking food game. Wasting my fucking brain away on this shit. No! Fuck again, dude! You're improving your reactions. That's true. Maybe I can make some like weird youtube video where i'm like this is the, the the secret right the true games to play get everyone to waste their fucking time <coughs> spaghetti arcade Can seize. Fuck your C's! Fuck your D's! God! enough time no you fuck i saw the timer on the corner of my eye i knew i had to clutch oh fucker oh that was a huge choke god fucking these bees man Getting so close now, but the C's and D's at the end, they're so tilting. I can't stop thinking about the C's and D's. 
It's the season these. You have no idea how hard it is, man. Remember. God. See you lunch. Oh, God. Season these, man. That's always a C and D. I don't know why, man. It's just the worst buttons for C and D. Fucking Inafune, man. Why? God! No, oh, you fuck! So tilting, dude. I can't believe I'm stuck on this shit. I don't know why, it's like the last three or four I'll always screw up in C and D. I don't know why. Oh god. The easiest way to do this is to reset the buttons on a joystick. Have the buttons go fully across A, B, C, D, and I would fucking smoke this game. You have to imagine the inputs by linking them some picture. I just keep saying C and D in my fucking head until I like, you know. And just to remember that it's on the right. The D or the C, I just have to remember one of those. This is just tilting. Oops. Fat fingered that one. Helps me drive impact on reaction. <laughs> this is way faster than drive impact. See lunch in your nightmares. God, I've gone close so many times though. I'm just focusing on speed at the beginning, then try to like calm down at the end, you know. It's like clockwork, dude. It's always C and D at the end. I don't know why. Because you don't get it for a while, and then I forget, right? Like, that's what's doing it, I think. Lunch. 
I need to play this like every morning when I wake up and just fucking hammer this shit down, you know? Just become a fucking god. Become the chef master that I was born to be. Just be cracked out of my damn mind. Going for a world record. <laughs> Bring the hitbox for the for the last one, man. We might have to bring the hitbox. I'm not even kidding. Team C lunch. Damn. It's hard. This is hard, man. I'm getting like, uh, like worn out now. I think my brain is fried now. You get diminishing returns if you play this for too long. Hydration break. Calm down, refocus. It's like pra <coughs> practicing a trial. Oh, I had it so many times, but I'm just so anti-clutch at the end. I don't know why. The worst one was the one where I did the wrong input on the last one. That was the worst one. Okay. I messed that up. Damn it, I have to take a break from this one. I'm like fried. I have to throw in the towel. I have to throw in the towel. We'll do the mission, we'll come back and do it again. I, I I can't even come close to it now. I'm like screwing up on the simple ones. Or maybe I'll try to do it in slow. Hold on. Ah! 
I started to speed up the end because I realized I was gonna do it, and then yeah, I pressed square though. I pressed the right button. It's just too slow. I did press the right button. <sighs> Don't look at the clock. I have to. If I didn't look at the clock, then I wouldn't have sped up, and then I would have been way off. The clock lets me know when I have to go faster. It's the pace. See lunch. Hey lunch. Spaghetti. See lunch. Hey lunch. See lunch. <coughs> I've been see close lunch. so many times. See lunch. See lunch. See lunch. Hey lunch. Spaghetti. See lunch. Curry rice. Curry rice. Hey lunch. Curry rice. Hey lunch. See lunch. See lunch. Curry rice. Damn, I'm hitting like an old man now. You sped up because you got four spaghetti in a row? Yeah, but I messed up on spaghetti at the end though. I was hitting the buns way faster near the end. Damn, that was a good RNG too. It's like excited fight, you don't have to heat up the more, you have to have it in the right pace. <laughs> the thing is is that if even if I go slower and take that extra moment, my speed is still faster. Because I'm improving my reactions, right? So if I force the speed, I could be bad too. There's obviously a little bit of luck in this as well if you get the same one over and over again. Enough time. Hey, lunch. Hey, lunch. Hey, lunch. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. Curry rice. Hey, lunch. Curry rice. Hey, lunch. Curry rice. Curry rice. Hey, lunch. Curry rice. Hey, lunch. See lunch. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. Damn, dude. That one, I felt like I had bad luck on that one because they kept on giving me different ones, but I think I was going fast on that one, which is weird. I had uh, two boss three seconds. I know I was looking at the timer. That's why I was saying I was surprised I was going fast because it kept on giving me different ones. Damn. 
lunch. See 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 lunch. Cody race. Hey lunch. Hey lunch. Spaghetti. Cody race. See lunch. See lunch. If you mess up and press one of the directions, but not circle, it still counts as a missed input. Actually, let me double check that. Yeah, if you press just one wrong direction, it'll screw up. I saw curry rice and I saw C, so I thought C lunch. That will give you the motivation. Money. So we're thanks for the fire bomb, man. <laughs> that will drown out the music a bit for me. <laughs> Thanks for the five, dude. Appreciate it. Damn it, dude. That was a good one. I hate how if you even press the wrong direction, it has to fail. Like, it won't let you get, like, press the wrong direction, but, like, oh yeah, and then change it, right? It's very strict. It makes sure that there is no. It wants you to be certain, you know? That's fucking cheap. Shit, I hesitated. Oh, my hands are getting sweaty now. I'm like obsessed with this. I don't know if this shit's healthy. Come on, how did I mess that one up, dude? How come this wasn't MGS5? <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Fucking serenity now. Curry rice, 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 curry rice
Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! Christ, dude. All right, let's go play some missions. That was an evil L pop. That was fucking Vega patch, man. Baning the desk. God. Where's number three? We should talk to him. He just gained a new skill. I think he's in the... Jesus Christ. Mm. Huh? Oh, this is comp- like, this is a Safeway shirt. It's like a grocery store. Oh, there's number three right here. Oh, that's weird. He doesn't say anything. Right. God, cancer, dude. Just cancer. If I sent these guys all to the a different spot yet, but I don't know what stats like determine if these guys are good at uh, too many servbots. Oh, right. I'll send one to the hard right. I'll send one to B4, and I'll send one to the bottom right. Curry, rice, and spaghetti, dude. God. My goddamn brain is fried right now. Curry, rice, and spaghetti. Jesus Christ. I want a mission two, three, four. Oh, yeah, this is the ruins. We haven't done. Uh, five. Farm action. There's a six, it's a puzzle. Farm action. Everything's level three. Okay, let's do the farm then. Get all these to level three, right? It's like confusing. What is, what? The goal of the mission is the what? The right t-shirt for the job? <laughs> yeah, I did. Got my fucking cooking shirt. Should I put on an apron? This time we're going after the uh, Sart farm. I don't think there's a lot of money at the ranch, Miss Tron. Of course there isn't. What we're after are the animals they have here. And we'll make cheese and milk and yogurt and stuff and sell it, right? No, that's too much trouble to bother with. Although it does sound kind of fun. No. We're going to do is sell them as quickly as possible. We've heard rumors that Mr. Loth is one of the owners of the Sart Farm, Miss Tron. Really? Well then, it's like two birds with one stone. I'll show him what happens if you mess with a T-Bone. Guess you're not all that hopeless after all. Alright, let's go. What robot are we using for this? Nice. We'll use the Gustav. Yeah, we'll use the Bazooka. Uh, we should change the color of our, our Gustav, too, at some point here. <sighs> A lunch. B lunch. C lunch. Look! 
Look, it's a piggy! A piggy! Oink, oink. Do pigs bite? Oh, yeah. Can't Bet you your ass still they and be quiet even for a few minutes? Ah, here he comes! The scary thing about pigs so is they'll eat anything. Alright, everything's ready. Go get those pigs! Yes, yes this one! I want every pig on this ranch in this truck! Let's go! Okay, why do we need the Gustav for this mission? Get all this, all six pigs. Target the pigs with a beacon bomb and have the servos catch them. Use the Gustav to protect them from enemies while you get the pigs, but be careful not to shoot the pigs. Okay, shouldn't be that hard. There are pigs in this house. Oh, we got milk. Let's destroy the evidence. That's our server. So there's no timer on this level? Wait, why are they jumping on top of the thing like that? There's a pig! Get him! He's making a run for it! Oh damn, they all need to gain up on him? Get him, boys. Oh, one got him! Wow, he lifted up by himself. Holy cow. So who can attack him? No one's attacking. Holy shit, he just chucked that pig like it was a bowling ball! And steal the milk. Get him, he's not looking. Got him. You got them all? Good! Let's move on to the other part of the ranch. Damn, how big is this ranch? So what do I do? Do I just go to the gate? I guess so. Alright. Get him! Oh, nice! The slide grab. Oh, what? Oh, no! Cops! Oh, I dropped my own truck. Take that. Oh, shit! Aim assist. I have so much health too, hey, from all those tanks. Oh, there's the, the, the ducks. Get this guy. Toss his ass in there. Hey, they did toss his ass in there. Nice. Get this guy. He's injured. Yeah, toss his ass in there too. Nice. Oh, there's a rabbit. I fucking hate rabbits. There's rabbits everywhere in Canada. It's super annoying. Toss that fucking rabbit. where you can't say that. Dude, there was like this... My old house, like, on my front steps, there's like this little like cave hole dirt thing underneath my front steps. And there was like a rabbit family living under there. God knows how long. It's tilting me. Every time I, I went outside, I could see the rabbit footprints in the snow leading from it. I knew they were in there. Should have ate it. No, they need to hide from me. I was too lazy to dig through the snow. Oh, cheese. Thanks. Get him. Get 
Damn, is that the speedy Surabot that's cracked out getting all those guys? Oh shit, can I hit the pig when he's holding him? I don't think so. And the bazooka's too OP. What do we got? Two more pigs here. There's a rabbit in here too. Yeah, Canada has a shit ton. At least Western Canada has a shit ton of wild rabbits. You literally see them all the time. You go to like any neighborhood, and they're they're running around everywhere. Go, go, go. Damn, he's not as fast as that other guy. Boom. Oh, a boss fight? Put the pig down. Uh oh. I don't know who or what these are, but I'm not going to let them get in our way. It's good that there's lots of missions where you can actually use the Gustav, because that's where all the upgrades and stuff I'm buying or investing in are. Oh, there's more than one? Okay. I'm gonna have to just jump shoot, because the, the bazooka has so much recovery if you just stand shoot. Oh, I can tell I'm so much stronger than I should be right now, because I'm barely taking damage and my life bar is massive. My Cerbots aren't that, that strong though, because I've you know, been doing a bad job training them. Nice. <laughs> Got him. That's one of Lode's bird bots. Destroy it. Come here to stop us. Well, we've got the pigs. I suppose we can let them go. Uh, wouldn't Loth not like the fact that we're stealing his, like, animals and we owe him money? Like, I, I don't understand how this is supposed to play out. Six pigs, how much are they worth? 150,000? Oh my god. Right, so did you beat uh, Legends 2 already? No, we're playing the Mega Man games in order. So this is the next game after Legends 1. If you max out your Surbots, you get the highest deeps. Yeah. You're talking about the, uh, maxing out their strength, though, right? No Surbots brains rating went up on this mission. On a hat. More attack cubes and bombs. Con engine room now? Jesus, why is there so many... The scouts is a good way to like, won't have to do the training. But when you're saying attack and speed, you're saying I have to max out the attack and speed of the eight sir bots I bring with me, right? Or the six sir bots I bring. Yeah. Okay. Russell, Russell. He's the one coordinating? Ms. Tron, I'm sorry the work on the engine room took longer than expected. But look at what we were able to make. Here, take it. High-density tank. 
Remember, sometimes it's better to retreat than fight. It's up to you to choose. Finally got everything ready. We're ready for you to take us on a mission with you anytime, Miss Tron. He built the RE engine by himself. Uh, curry. Spaghetti. Used to make your storage compartment for your robot. And sell it if I were you. time it is. I'm in the lab. Need to be smaller. I don't know if this thing will work, but let's try it. Oh, it does. High density tank. What do you think? Is it small enough? You bet it's small enough. We could be able to get it on the Gustav, no problem. We should attach it right away. Let's do that. Uh, oh my god, 300,000! That's all we have! I'll never get this damn armor. Okay, so that means we need to strategically make sure uh, the speed of like the eight servbots that we take and the strength are like the strongest. We need our best warriors. We're broke now. Uh, we need. There's another mission. There's a puzzle mission we haven't seen yet. So I'm gonna check that out. What kind of puzzle it is? Let's take our scouts out. What what stat determines scouting or none of them? It doesn't matter. I really don't like the scouting thing. Slow, slow servbot. That's the guy you play as, dude, on that stupid mission. Oh, you can turn them around. It's kind of cool. Looks a hot bath after work. Get these guys to go in the center areas. Sniper. Okay. Uh give some guys some attack items. Anyone who's not juiced out yet. Not juiced out. Okay. Save too. So what was that mission? Well, this is a farm level 2. We can still do that real quick because everything's level 3. What's the highest level of each mission? 3? Because look how much is any. It's 400,000 a pop. Okay, let's get a super army this time. So attack and speed, you said, hey? Sir, bot. Change servbots. So what's the sloth stat about? So we got number one. Wait, you can only change one? A three two five six nine are kind of So speed two. There's rapid. Rapid's like. A no-brainer, that's the one I 
So three, two. There's no three threes, right? I have to do that stupid thing over and over again. There's a two four here. Number 27's cracked on speed. Who else is speedy? See, I got... Man. But some of these guys, they're like... Their attack is not... You can't max out their attack anymore. You know? So we need more well-rounded guys. 3-2, obviously. 3-2. Slings. Sniper here. Three, two, four, six, nine, twenty-seven. Laziness, if it maxes out, you can't use them for a while, but how does it increase? Look, it's another piggy. Where are the cows? <laughs> I don't see any cows. Must be in another pasture in a different oh, I forgot to change the, the color again. Shall we go find them? You bet. Keep your eyes open though. Those bird bots may come looking for another fight. Aye, aye, aye ma'am. Uh, ma'am. Oh, I gotta send, I gotta choose different ones for scouts then? Okay, I'll have to remember that. Damn, I'm gonna get cows this time. Cheese and milk. The cows are gonna be faster than the pigs. I see some enemies already. No cows here. Damn, still three shots to take these guys out. There's a pig. Go, go, go. Look how fast those two servos are, they're crazy. Running away and get him. Where are the cow? We haven't seen one cow yet. This might be the next area. We we'll check it out here quickly. I gotta see like a 100% playthrough of this game. See how to play it optimally. There's so much you need to understand with this game. Make sure to leave one star with max slot because it will allow you to do a new minigame. Oh, okay. 
it's like a motivation mini game to get them to work again. Yeah, I'll make sure. I make that big one. Here's all these cows. Oh, he's riding them. Oh shit! I, did I blow up the cow? Oh, he's attacking me! My god! Can't hurt these guys. I can't even touch them. Odd. <laughs> oh, now I can hit them. Okay. It's kind of cool. Go, go, go! You got them all? Good! Let's move on to the other part of the ranch! Yes, Mr. Swami! It's a sleep minigame. <laughs> uh, wait. Did I take the wrong way? came from this way, didn't I? I couldn't go out the door on the right? Now that I think about it, I didn't use that grab move to see if I can grab the cows myself. Oh, there's a look out. Oh, there's an angry farmer running right after me. He's crazy. <laughs> oh, he just ran to me and knocked himself out. Wait, can we take the farmer? Please tell me to take the farmer. No, we can't. Damn. Oh, the farmer got up. He started attacking. Let's yeah, see if I can take the cow myself. I can knock him over. Oh, what? No, oh, the farmer sabotage. Go, go, go. My health bar is just so insanely big now. And that armor, I guess, is going to reduce the damage by another third four other oh yeah they're probably talking about the rabbits 
and the two, pigs and shit. Uh, three? Miss John, we got all the cows! Good work! Let's get out of here! Nice. Yeah, I gotta remember, change the goose off color. We're gonna get a lot of money for this mission. Oh, we're right, boss. How much damage we're doing this thing? Oh my god! Oh my god! We're so powerful! That was insane! The game recommended me to level up the Serbots 1 through 8. We should take that speedy... The speedy gourmet one, I think, is 1 to 8, too. 420,000 zenny for those cows. We even got steak. All, like, the Serbots' brains ratings are, like, maxed out. Bandit thief of a farmer, yeah. Uh, I don't think we have any more of those attack cubes, do we? No, we don't. I'll be right back one second. Okay, level up the speed is like, that is if you're a masochist, you know, like, that shit is too much. Like, that's like one per stream kind of thing, you know? The train the strength is nice and chilled. Those games are expensive on eBay, they didn't make too many copies. Maxed out, maxed out. Okay, number four. Wait. Oh, right, because that's the speed one. Whoops. Uh, shit. No, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. No. Spaghetti. Come on, we, we, we need to stop this. Of course, one is the strength. Whoops. Okay, wait, I'm confused. So with these two training things, I can max out every Serbot's strength and speed stat. If I really wanted to grind this whole thing out. Strength and speed I can max out no problem. And then brains, I take them out on missions. And then sloth, I send them out to scout or whatever. So the only thing I'm confused about at this point then is uh is these items you have to give them for your their their uh specialties, like I'm assuming some of the items are from scouting, so like, how do you know wh who to send who where? That's the only thing I'm kind of trying to figure out, how, how would you know? Okay, course one is strength. Maxed out. Oh, he's, he can go up to four? Where's my damn bazooka? Damn, I didn't get the curry.
Damn it, I didn't get that curry. Because I had the bazooka. That's kind of cheap. The bazooka destroyed the curry. Oh, no shit. Alright, pay attention to that. Oh, there's iframes when you when you're in the middle of a throw. Good to know. Fuck. Where's my bazooka, dude? Oh my god. How the fuck did I mistime that? There's no bazookas! Where the fuck's my bazooka? Oh my god. What is this? Is it? This can't be RNG, is it? I didn't destroy enough targets, so I guess I didn't reveal the bazooka. Shit. Get the double win. There we go, that's the good RNG. Now we just need bazooka and we're good. There it is. Mm. There we go. No! Oh no! I missed it! Oh no! I thought I had enough time. This one is way less stressful than the fucking spaghetti curry. Play this shit any day besides that one. Drive me fucking off the ball. Oh shit, he deflected the bomb. Now he's gonna throw the curry. Damn, I didn't get the double. Damn, I didn't get the... Oh god, dude. Yeah, I, I noticed the higher the strengths, the higher the stat you're trying to level up, the harder the training game will be. Which is good. It's definitely the way it should be. my curry there we go on bazooka ggs no took the extra time to make sure i got the double <gasps> why did he slip <coughs> what was that you guys saw that he slipped 
So what, I just failed because your guys slips at the wrong time? The curry makes you slip at the end? No, you slip, you slip before you eat the curry. You slip all the time. Shouldn't have slipped? What the fuck does that mean? Curry uh, stops the timer. Shit. Shit. <clears throat> Try the next level. What? What? Oh man, this game is grindy. You can't fuck around. If you want to level all these guys up max stats, you're in this for the long haul. It's like a fucking 40 hour game. And the speed one, my god, I can't even imagine. That's a fuck that. Gonna be all your fucking mind. Oh my god, that's bullshit. Shit. Plus no bazooka, probably. What? I can't get the double on that one. What? You fuck, he deflected it. And I got a, a sweep. Oh my god, bro. I'm telling you, there's some, there's some times where you can't do this. Depending on when he trips, I'm telling you. There is some... I'm not saying it's a big part of it. But there's a small part of luck on this. I swear. At least the speed one. Well, the speed one has some luck too, if you get the spaghetti like a million times in a row. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm not even close. I'm not even close. Quick turning causes the slip? Are you sure? Hmm. 
Yeah, I guess so. But what does that mean? <laughs> I mean... I don't know how I'm supposed to get 50 points. One thing I can do is I can I can hit him, like, hit the targets in front of that other guy to make sure he's lifting as many targets in front of him as possible. But fuck, I wasn't even close last time. I didn't make any mistakes. And this is the level up one Serbot, as opposed to using the attack cube? Wouldn't it be f way more efficient to just grind scouting missions? Fuck me, dude. Flip the curry, bro. Oh, I would have did it if I got the double. Well, at least I know you don't need the curry. Oh, if I just took a, a second wait, I should have anticipated that. Okay, I'm starting to get an idea how to play this optimally. You just gotta make sure you destroy the targets uh, in this guy's path. You don't just prioritize on the the point of the targets. You want to make as many targets available as possible. Shit! Fuck sakes. I don't know. I like. I don't know if, if even mastering the mini games will be faster because you can potentially get like three attack cubes. You know. This piece of shit, man. You fucking plays me every time with that curry. God, that guy tilts me. That fucking curry, dude. I need it, but like... He always throws it at the worst time.
like when I see the I have to like he I have to hesitate to grab the the curry or the 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 bazooka. I don't like man, my score was terrible. Like what was that? Even with the curry. Next time I see the bazooka, I have to wait for the curry. Shit. Oh. Damn, no bazooka, eh? Hey? Yeah, if you if you know ahead of time how hard the mini games are gonna be, and then yeah, you st you stalk in the queues and then save them for the last thing. That definitely makes sense on the second playthrough. But I still think like there's gotta be some stuff you can do with the scouting missions as well to reliably get these cubes, and then even then you can, you can still be good, you know. Like, efficiency-wise, I'm sure it's faster to just go to a mission, quit, and then have the scouts come back, you know? What? Yeah, you can shoot two guys with a single bazooka. The, the main trick of this is I need to clear the targets in this guy's path. So he puts them up as soon as possible. I need... It's more important than the points of the targets themselves. Because that brings the bazooka faster, it, it brings everything faster. Very soon. Fuck. Okay. Oh, the curry automatically blew up there? That's weird. If I got the curry there, I would've I would have got it. I don't it, it blows up if there's a bomb on the floor where it lands. It's pretty whack. See, I think I already lost just because of that first toss. I hate how you can't restart, dude. Fuck. It tilts me. You have to hold that for 50 seconds. That's another reason why doing these is not efficient. I swear there's some randomness to this thing.
One, 99 second one touch restart? Yeah, every second counts. You lose a second, it's over. Let me pop the sands. To fucking... Waste my time. Waste them over a minute. And I know I'm gonna lose already. I'm throwing them off a bit. Shit, that was really bad luck. Damn. Most important part is the very beginning. Nice. I'm trying to pay attention to where I'm, where I'm throwing this on the ground so I know if I'm gonna get the double hit or not, right? It's really important. Now is maxed out. Special skill, bazooka. Oh wow. Oh fuck. Uh anything else we can reason? Oh yeah, I'm gonna change the color to the Gustav. Where's the E Tank 7 is here now? God. No, oh, fuck this. I'm getting the armor. I'm tired of being close to that armor and always something else to buy. E Tank 7, how much health do you have in this game? Now, who's the guy that uh, changes the color of the Gustav? It's the painter. Oh, I think he's in the appraiser room. That guy still doesn't say anything. Oh yeah, we can gamble. Forgot, we haven't gambled in a while. Let's go gamble. <laughs> Let's make money at the casino. Kaching. We didn't play high low. We played uh bingo last time. High low baby. Hi. I, of course. Fuck yeah. This is where it gets tricky. Let's go high. Fuck it. 
Oh yeah. This is whack gambling? Yeah, this is 50-50. 50-50 are pretty good odds for a casino. Actually, that's insane odds for a casino. Okay, low for sure. Dude, we're cracked right now. I've guessed so many times in a row. Holy fuck. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. I've guessed every single one. No! Well, I popped the sirens though to see if, uh, what would happen if I guessed them all right. I need to know. <laughs> I went for the double high. Oops, I went low last time, right? Wait, is it random? Oh no, it's not. Okay. It's 105,000 zenny. Not everyone can get this far. What do you say, another round? Oh, that's it? Okay. I'm just gonna repeat what I what I did. And, and uh... What's it called? Fail on purpose. Uh, okay. I'd rather do the bingo one. They they do it in a way that they make sure they do it in a way where um if you like constantly load your fi your file it's not worth it. I can't believe how many times I guessed right though. I I don't like how you can only choose three cards. Let's get that 13, 3, and a 12. That's one. We need a 3 now or a 13. Okay, that's not good. Come on, 13, 3. Still need a 13. <gasps> we just need a 3, baby. Three. Oh, are ten or a three? Ten or three? Ten or three? Ah! Oh, I saw the three were off. <gasps> Yay! Bingo! How about just one more time? <laughs> Fucking the casino bait, bro. How about you continue playing when you have lower odds than the house? That's a great idea when you gamble. Wow, we actually want money. This one's free, yeah. Maybe it's in the meeting room? Oh, here it is. What do we got? We use stylish. Which one you guys want now? We tried villainous and stylish. Which one you guys want? We got original, we got a heroic, hip hop, cute, and teasel bond. It better not be pink.
Yeah, you don't know what they look like. It's kind of weird they don't show you. <laughs> okay, so mission four... Or, hold on. This is so fucking confusing how they don't, like... The way they move these things are not in order. It tilts me, dude. One, two, three... Four... Five... Six. Which one was five? The farm. Wow, 800,000 zenny? Oh, it's another puzzle level, guys. Let's go. Mission container two. The goal of this mission is to go back to the harbor and get more cargo containers. Guys, I love these missions. We should just play these ones. But too bad you can't farm them. As you know, I'm an expert on these levels. Oh, it's like a Today, fucking we hot to pink. Some fruit, okay? Boy, there's sure a lot of containers in the way. Yeah, it looks like we have to use a crane. We'll able to get them all. This might be harder now. Strong, look! There's a forklift over there! Oh, a I forklift? To help you. Um, I appreciate it. But are you sure you know what to do? <laughs> you need a yeah, you need a forklift where to license. Which container when? Let's see. If there's a fruit container, mm, I'll carry it to the ship. Well, that's basically it. <laughs> Tell you what, I'll move the containers out of the way for you, okay? Hooray! These servbots, the way they talk right, reminds Let's me of the, the chat so first, much. Okay? I might start calling you guys servbots. They they talk just like you guys. What do we what do I mean? You know exactly what I mean. Don't play dumb. You know exactly. Okay, I'm kinda confused though. Uh how do I use the how do I get him to use the crane? It says, I clear the way, and then they use the crane? I can't throw this in the water? Why can't I? Oh, because the ship's in the way. Oh, interesting. Okay. Uh, fuck. Do I have to, has to be parallel to where... Let's see. Now can you grab it? The hell is a crate all the way over here? I don't know how to use this this forklift. Oh, let's just use up my turns. It says we have to clear the path. I understand that. Oh. Hold on, where, how do I like make him use the crane? Uh huh? Yeah. 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 Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Play steel wood containers in the yeah, we already know that. <clears throat> yeah, we know this. It doesn't tell me anything about this fucking forklift. What? Where where am I? Am I at the harbor? Where are you? I'm asking where the puzzle god is. 
Out to lunch. That's for damn sure. Oh shit. Hold on. Fucked up. Uh, okay. I'm still trying to understand what this this forklift thing is trying to tell me. Uh, we got two moves here, right? Now what? Like, if we can use the forklift, then the path is clear. Okay, but how do I use the thing? How do I use this fucking thing? Why doesn't the game tell me, man? God. Oh, you can switch the camera around? Fuck, I didn't know that. Holy shit, I- Six. Wait, oh, oh, you could just press L2 to, okay. Did was I always, did I always have this? I don't think I was able to help him with that. Um, I'm sorry, Miss Tron. I I can't pick the container up. Oh, I'm in the fucking way. I got it, Miss Tron. Oh shit. Oh my god, look at this little bastard go! Okay. What? He can actually grab it from that far? Oh, this makes the puzzle so much harder now. Now this little bastard can grab anything as long as it has a, a direct path to it. Now this shit's next level. Where's the damn crab thing? Oh my god. It's over here. It's melons! Oh, and the other one's way over here! Holy shit! I sir, couldn't finish Pokemon as a kid because boulder puzzles? What boulder puzzles? He's forklift certified, you aren't. <laughs> uh. Okay, so we don't want to waste a turn grabbing this then if the forklift can just grab it. Yeah, no shit does a container fill of apples. Or you have to, or you won't grab them until it's the end of my turns. Oh, I won't let you fuck around, I guess. Alright, how do we get these damn melons? Oh, there's one crate there I can put to the side. Put it in there. I want to do this in the fewest amount of moves possible. Once again, we simply want to just clear a path for the for the forklift. I gotta put him in the forklift first. Oh, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna this bastard to grab this shit. Damn, look how fast he grabbed that! Oh my 
God. He's cracked. Yeah, so now that the forklift doesn't take a turn, it's just all about using every turn to lift boxes now. Got the damn melons. Three lifts and only two boxes. So we have to use two turns just to get this one. No, not really. I can move this one and then grab it from there. But then we still need to clear up this path here. This one's... That's one, and then... Need to make a bridge across the top of that boat, but I don't know how I'm gonna get that that one steel crate over. So I do it like this. Hold on, one, two. No, but then I can't get that. I can't get across the stupid boat. I don't think I can do this in two moves. No, because you can't put this here, right? Piece of shit. <laughs> oh, no, I can. Yeah, okay, we're good. In fact, with this forklift thing, there might be a multiple com multiple ways to do these puzzles now, too. Did it and the melons. That's the last container. Damn it, thanks for the 33, man. This game is the ultimate reflex trainer. It's the everything trainer. The brain, the reflex, anger management. It's got it all. Alright, let's go to the next dock. Okay. This game will push you to your absolute limits. Oh, what the hell is this map? Oh man, this is a mess. Oh, dude, the melons are all the way over here. This is nasty. This one is nasty. My forklift. I can help you move things with this. Just mm. 
There's a rumor that I didn't play this game before LCQ. <laughs> oh, shit. Get this bad boy. Love the other surfbot with holding the flag on the boat. This game is so addictive. Every time I like check my clock, it's always past midnight. All right, we got the melons. We have three, three apples left. Five moves. That apple is in such a nasty spot. Well, I have to move this crate. What? Where can I move it then? Fuck. Oh my god. What? Oh shit. There is some nastiness here, but we have five moves. Like we got a lot of moves, but they want us to do some rearranging here. I I hated on Minesweeper, did I? I don't remember ranting about Minesweeper. I really ranted about Minesweeper. The only other crit I can move is this one. Oh wait, that's a two block bridge? Oh my god, it is. What? Can I go back and, oh my god. How do I? What? So the bridge has to be on this side? insane no wait I can't even get to this side unless I put two crates here hold on what is this next level shit we have to do this top part first This part is next level. What's going on here? I can move this crate. I can move this, but it will waste a turn. Only crate I can move is this one. I have five moves. I have to remember I have five moves. One. This doesn't help me. It helps me get the wooden crate. What happens if I go like this? What does that do for me? I can't jump across. That's fucking crazy. This one's really tricky. Was during the Apex stream when you were joking about your mouse pad? 
I don't know. Someone, so, oh, someone mentioned. Uh, oh, that'd be really the stopping power would be really good for Minesweeper. That's who, that's who brought it up. Minesweeper is an okay game. It's an old game. I'm not. I'm not. I don't even know how to play that game really properly. I know that it. it like when you click on a spot and it shows the number, it, it tells you how many mines are in that area. And then you kind of just use like deduction to kind of figure out and then uncover it. Not really. I wouldn't say it's the most fun game. It's pretty mundane. It's not stimulating enough. Like spaghetti and rice curry, you know? How is it possible to I get across here? Unless I waste a turn, but that would be so next level. This one's fucking tricky. Yeah, you'd have to build the bridge for that one on the, on the right. Wouldn't it make sense to grab that crate? It'd waste a turn. So we have to build a direct bridge to this apple. How do I do that? The only way to do that is to... Unless I use three steps, but that doesn't sound right at all. puzzles again where it's like I think you have to burn a turn that's why I can't figure it out just they really want you to waste one turn we only need two turns at the bottom the bottom part is simple we have five lifts but I don't know if it wants me to make a triple block break I don't know if there's a way to make a two to this apple directly there's no way because this thing is here. There's no way, there's no way to move that. Maybe. Hold on. No, because once I move this, I'm fucked, right? Oh, it won't even let me move this one. Wait. Okay, that gives us a huge hint what it wants us to do then. It's not a waste you get the cargo on the boat sail. I know, but you guys know what I mean. Like, you waste a turn not accomplishing anything. It, 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 you never required to do that until that one recent level. That's why I'm saying that now, because I try to think of uh, how to be the most efficient on every turn, right? But I have to think about the big picture. So now we know this crate, I have to move it to the right or, or up or down. So we have to waste a turn here. Ah! 
Where can I put this bad boy? This guy's blocked over here. There's too many turns wasted trying to even get to one of these guys. Hmm, can I use that wooden crate down here? To save me a turn. I wonder if that's some high level shit. To and that that wooden crate is like a red earring. Just some terrible fucking high level shit. But I don't know if I can accomplish a bridge without that wooden crate. I don't think I can. But I can use the other wooden crate to come back. Hold on, this is like... There's a lot of things I can do here. This one's wild. I can now use this crate here. Two wooden crates. Still need to clear the path. Well, this is Sir Buffy, whose only purpose is getting in your way. <laughs> He's there to assist me. Maybe there's more than like forklifts in the future. I don't know. I can I can toss him in the forklift. <laughs> I still need to use two steps for this one, though. But I think I gotta borrow this wooden crate here. I think that's one of the tricks. There's only two wooden crates total, right? Yeah. I, I, ha I haven't even figured out how to get this apple on this side. Like, it's not even a matter of steps. I can't even figure out how to even get it in the first place. Like it wants me to use like three fucking steps to get it. I think you gotta like, I have to use, start using the forklift in between my turns to clear up even more space. I think that's one thing I'm not doing here. Get in there, you little bastard. Focus on one part of the puzzle at the time at a time isn't that your own advice? Yeah, but now I'm I'm starting to try to see the combinations using both wooden crates. There's one wooden crate on the bottom, so now I'm looking at both now. How the fuck do I get that one uh, crate out of the way?
<laughs> I'm targeting the guy, poor guy with the flag. I got it, Miss Trump. Four steps, though. I have to, I have to do this one step here no matter what. So that brings me down to three. So I grab this wooden crate. I need to move this now. That's one. Two, three, but I won't get the melon. I want the melon. Yeah, I'm one move. Sh I'm one move short. I want the melon. Close though, very close. Something about rearranging th this one is, is the problem. This one takes up so many turns. So this one we have to get out of the way for sure. We gotta figure out how to do this one efficiently. Get this bad boy out of the way. So we grab it from here, we can't move it. We grab this one, we can't move this one either. The only choices we have is to move the green, which we can't. So I have to move this crate. There's no other way to start this without moving this one. How do I do this efficiently? Still need to clear up a space for this guy. So I have to use three turns. This is like the most efficient way I can clear up that space. Now we're back in the same situation. Four turns. So I want to grab that melon without using that wooden crate here too. Then how do I do the top? It's a thing. So I only got two moves. There's no way. To, there's no way to even get to this crate. Well, yeah, I can move the apple, I guess. <coughs> this top part is so difficult. Just getting this, this here is so inefficient. It takes so many turns. <coughs> I can't target while I'm lifting something up, can I? Oh, you can? <coughs> I didn't even, even know you can do that. Maybe that's what it wants me to do. That's bullshit. Oh 
But I don't know if that helps me, though. Does that help me? Because I still gotta block my path with this. But now that gives me some more combinations I can think of. Gives me access to the wooden crate earlier. Move this out of the way so I can move this to the right. I don't know if that's useful or not. Even if that's not what it wants us to do, though, I'll have to remember that in a future mission that I can do. I can lift and target. I don't think that it matters on the other side because. Uh, Still need to make a two-way bridge. It's two turns in the bottom. Okay, hold on. I think I know how to do this one. No back seats? No, no. Yeah, I want to figure it out myself. <clears throat> See, even if I made the bridge here, how does that help me? Because I was thinking of bringing the, the, this wooden crate down. Instead of using the wooden crate ribbon right here. It still doesn't help me. Take a look. It would still be the same shit. But it gives me two it gives me three turns? Let's see here. Oh, I think I got it. That one was extremely difficult. Like I get the trick with the, the like I as soon as I realized I can bring the other wooden crate back, I knew I was trying the game was trying to trick me into using that wooden crate that was right beside it. I thought that was a little too obvious. That's why that's why I was focusing more on, on using that wooden crate on the below. I don't know if lifting up the crate and targeting helped me though, but I think it saved me one turn. I don't like how the game doesn't tell you you can do that though. I guess we have to realize it. Whoops! No, I forgot to grab the melon first! Whoops! <laughs> no! Let's do it again. It did tell me why. It told me I can lift a crate, and it told me I can, uh, what's it called? It can target a, a, a crate as well, but I don't think it told me I could do both at once. I, I did that last time. It didn't say you couldn't? Well, what's your point? Your point is, if it doesn't tell me I can do something, then that means I can. 
How does that make any sense? <laughs> that was like... That would be like the worst developer excuse ever. <laughs> we didn't say you couldn't. <laughs> Why would the game waste time telling me things I can't do? I think, like, it's important for the game to tell you all the core mechanics, right? Because it's it's important to solving these puzzles. I'm, it's not. It's like it's not like it was like the biggest like secret ever. Like I figured it out myself. Just saying, would have sped things up, you know. If I knew all the rules I can do. Still, the it was still the puzzle is still tough. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm just making sure I'm doing this the same way I did last time. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I remember I used this wooden crate instead. I'm just I'm thinking with the other steps after it. Oh fuck! I fucked up. Like one. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it's not the difficulty of the puzzle I'm complaining about. It's, it's hard. But nothing's worse than, like, some stupid mechanic that you don't know. The game doesn't tell you, right? Yeah, <laughs> I hope they don't repeat the same mistake and don't grab that melon. Like I said, this is this is tame. Like the lifting up and then targeting whatever. It's not like some crazy thing where I'm like, I can't believe it and tell me. I'm just kind of like slightly like, huh, eh, they should have said you can do that. Like I think it's important. It's, it's not like it just completely gives away the puzzle, you know, it's not a big deal. <clears throat> Yeah, right, like, like if you're, exactly, like a big part of the puzzles is like, you want to know all the rules, right? That's why it can be frustrating, because like, you'll, you'll be on a puzzle and you'll be like, do I have all the clues or do I have all the pieces of the puzzle to even solve it? You don't even know, right? So it's important that the game lets you know those kind of things. So you don't waste your fucking time. Otherwise, you just feel That's like cheaped out, you know. Containers. That's the last container. We did it. All right, let's go to the next dock. All right, if that puzzle was that hard, let's see. Let's see what level it takes me to now. Round toi. Holy shit! Where that melon? It. Oh. What is this? Five steps? And this melon is on another planet. Holy shit. Okay, I'm just trying to think here. I, how, how the fuck am I going to get this melon up here? Okay, first off, can I even make a bridge on the left side? You get in there while I figure this out. Oh, 
there's a stupid thing here, so I can't go around. <laughs> what the hell is with this apple over here? There's one crate in this whole level. I think that's good that there's one crate. That makes it easier on my brain. one looks savage dude I'm not even worried about the melon now I'm worried about this apple over here what the hell is this this one looks nasty dude well the only way to get this one is to use the wooden crate here that's there's just no doubt in my mind that that's how you get that one but I only have three steps left What is this shit? <laughs> this one's ridiculous! Get to this wooden crate now. I don't have a clear path. This is gonna be one of those th ones where you have to lift up and move shit out of the way again. Oh man, this one looks brutal. <laughs> this one does not look like a good time. One in reverse, though. Three moves. So, so that's only two blues and a crate. But how the fuck do I get that? <laughs> how the fuck do I get this apple here then? I don't even know how I get this damn crate across. You need the crate to get that apple over here. There's no other fucking way. One move, that's it. That's all you get. How? <laughs> How is this one possible? <laughs> Something has to be moved out of the way, like one of these apple containers is in the way. I guess I have this in my hands and then I direct it? Can I do that? Hold on. See if it's even possible first. I can't jump on boxes with this in my hands, right? Can I angle this shit, like from here? Oh my god, you can. Okay, so that means the path has to be cleared for me with this in my hands, and then I move up and toss the last piece down. 
All right. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, okay. So we got this part figured out. Now we just need to clear the path. How can I clear this path in the fewest amount of steps possible? The crate is the last step. And we know how to clear the path. So now we have one. We have five moves to do this. I just need to ask myself, do I need to move this one? Do I have to move this one? steps. I say yes. Puzzle god shit going on. Puzzle god shit. Alright. Are you guys fucking ready? For your minds to be blown? Alright. Alright, hold on. But can I angle this shit? Cause I'm in- I'm in this idiot's way now. Can I hit this from over here? Come on. Come on! Um. <sighs> Fucking T-Bone's in the way! Wait, 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 oh. I got it, guys. I got it. Fucking puzzle god, dude. Puzzle god. We figured this one out faster than the last one. Puzzle fucking god. Yeah. Remember, get. The we gotta get the melon. Don't make me fuck up on that. I'm getting the melon. Four apples is not enough. And then we're gonna slam this shit down like this. Uh! Give me my damn melons. <sighs> this one felt good, guys. This one felt real good. This was the high level shit. Oh my god. It, hey, what's up, Sonic? Did you just finish your stream? Best friend is melons. I almost lost my melons, dude. This one was tough, but that last one was like galaxy brain shit. Puzzle God deserves a rest. <laughs> Jesus, it's fucking kids games, man. I don't know.
I'm not gonna have a puzzle like that in RE8, that's for damn sure. God. What's this you're saying, Sonic? Project Dal Who? Oh! <laughs> you're talking about the prize pool? I, I was actually getting, uh, I was actually salty at the beginning of my stream because, uh, there are some really miserable comments that I've been seeing around. Like, people are trying to, like, downplay it and shit. It's really weird. Like, it's just, like, really negative misery. Like, I don't even understand how you can even think about it negatively. It's nothing but good news. Like, it's strange. Like, I'm hearing shit like, oh... Uh, you know, you shouldn't play a game just for money. Why you guys just- then you might as well play other games, you know? Like, you might as well play League of Legends. And then I'm hearing shit like, um... Uh... You're- you're not even gonna- you're not gonna get first place anyways. Like, who the f- I was, I was like, who the fuck are you to tell me I'm not gonna get first place, you know what I mean? <laughs> Projection much? Like... You don't tell anyone they can't get first place, right? It's really strange, like... It's... I just haven't- I haven't seen a reaction like that, it's odd. And, and another thing too, it's like, it's not just about first place. Like I said, the third place prize... Is more money than the first pl pra uh, place prize this year. And then on top of that, there's gonna be even more tournaments. We got online premieres. And if there's more money, that means more players, which means bigger player base, more competition, even more tournaments on the side that are not even CPT. I mean, it's what we want! I, I gotta understand, it's nothing but good news. More money means more support. I, it's, it's, that's the way to go up. I, I mean, what the fuck? <laughs> Crabs in a barrel mentality? What's that mean? I've never heard of that in my life. Crabs in a barrel? Oh, I gotta look that up. That sounds high level. I told you about the story about the scorpion and the frog. Crabs in a barrel. Is that a thing? Uh, let's see here. Crab barrel syndrome. Holy shit, this is actually a thing. I've never heard of this in my life. Uh... If I cannot do it, neither can you. Mixed with jealousy or hatred and turned into behavior. <laughs> what? Why is it called crab barrel syndrome though? I don't get it. <laughs> uh, crab mentality involves pulling down anyone who achieves or is about to achieve success greater than yours. Vesper did not go to school. They taught you guys that in school? I never heard of this shit. Huh. That's cool. Crabs pull down other crabs who try to escape a trap. Why why would the crab why would the crabs do that though? Cause they're trying to get out too? <laughs> I, I don't understand. Do crabs actually do that? Because that's that shit's dark. Really? That's fucked up. Crabs are assholes? Oh, shit. They think they are saving the other crabs. Oh. Weird. That's fucked up. You shouldn't have told me that. That's dark. 150k? Wait, we barely got any money for that! That mission was so hard compared to the other ones. Compared to the cow mission? God. Anyways, yeah, it's it's I mean it's not like it's everyone thinking this. The majority of people are, are super pumped about this. But I just found it strange. There there are actually people out there that are just so I, I don't know what the word is, right? They're so plugged in to this like poverty FGC thing. <laughs> that it's just like it's like no matter what, they just cannot be happy. Like it's it's actually wild to me, you know? It's just not healthy. 
It's just not a healthy way of thinking, you know? It's it's crazy. So yeah, I'm just like, whoa. Just wanted to bring that up. This reminds me of the same Intel and Nintendo fans. <laughs> It's not, it's, Nintendo fans is weird. It's like Nintendo fans are more like they're satisfied no matter what, you know. This is uh, this is something else entirely. This is like I don't know. It's like you can just never be happy. It's weird. It's like strange misery. It's weird. <laughs> crab crab barrel mentality. This that's hardcore. I never heard of that before. It's cool. Um, hold on. What? Let me see. Did I? Let me, I'm gonna pop Sans real quick. I'm gonna see if does that mission have a a level two that we can do? Cause I'm on, I want everything on level three. Oh, there's a container level two, guys. Should we do it? Fuck! It's so late though. No, we better stop. I'll do it. I'll do it next stream. Fuck, dude. I want to play it though. I'll send the scouts out. Learn something new every day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Even the puzzle god can learn things, you know. I teach you, you guys teach me. <laughs> Street Fighter 6, the savior of fighting games. God. Just saying that out loud must burn some people's retinas. Thought it was Project L, but no. It was Street Fighter all along. They they brought out the COO. This guy came in with a biker suit. <laughs> and he had to be the one to announce the one million dollars. The COO. Project L's can't. I mean, dude, Project L's gonna come in with like a $10 million first place prize. We'll be like, whoa! <laughs> but uh, until that game actually comes out, you know? <laughs> What's the max out sloth? Four, I'm assuming? So 34 and 36. These guys are ready to like fall asleep. Project is so far away, it, it might as well be cancelled. I mean, I, I respect that they're waiting for it to be perfect, you know? I respect that. You do kind of lose- it is kind of bad at to- you kind of lose your, um, your momentum, you know? Sometimes, it's not- I don't know, like some games are in development hell. Project L is not really development hell, they're just really taking their time with it, you know? But it, it definitely- it definitely is bad. After, if you wait too long. But, uh, like I said, man, I was... I was so insanely hyped for Project L. And now, now, like I said, now that I, that I see what kind of fighting game has turned out to be, it's just... To me, it's just... It's the combination of that plus, you know, the Street Fighter 6 hype, where I'm, like, not as crazy anymore. Now it's like, when it's out... I'm gonna check it out, but I'm not like foaming from the mouth, shilling for it. You know? It would have been the normal game if it came out 2017, but there's so much competition. Well, another thing too is that like Street Fighter 6, because like we're all we're talking about how Project L is like, it's gonna show us how free to play is done right and all that shit, right? But Street Fighter 6 is also gonna show us how. A triple A fighting game is done right as well. The other side of the spectrum, you know? So it's good. We I mean we want both games to be out to see that and set the bar. You know? And it, like I said, I Street Fighter 6, man, it's just been 
just everything in that. I just never imagined the game to be like it is now, you know? Like, I, I can't believe it. It's just way crazier than I thought it'd be. Yeah, I, I mean, not the, the no 1v1 or the option to play the game like with a team is definitely a good way to go. It's just, I still, I still think Project L should have been a platform fighter. I still think that would have been the best choice, but it is what it is. <laughs> we'll see how they deal with some of the, the champs. It should have been a platform fighter. I think that would have been perfect. I know we have a lot of platform fighters these days, but... Damn, I want to keep playing, guys, but I... I need to do some stuff at home. I need to rearrange stuff. I almost have this room done, and I need to finish up uh, my bedroom now. I gotta set up my new stereo. I have to play more of this tomorrow. You know what I had a dream about last night, guys? Spaghetti. Curry rice. Lunch A. Lunch D. B lunch. C lunch. Oh, God. It's traumatizing. Play Ape Escape on April Fool's Day and name your title Killer15. That was the plan. I don't know if I actually did stream on April Fool's Day, but that was like the ultimate joke. <clears throat> it was going to be amazing. I was going to do it when KOF15 first came out. So I thought it'd be hilarious. Will there be any Street Fighter 6 DLC by the time Evil comes? Oh, if there is, that'd be insane. And it would probably be like DQ from Evil. Oh, man. Okay, where do we leave off here? We, uh... I need to see, like, the list. <clears throat> I forgot which... Oh, yeah, we we're gonna do a puzzle level next. I sent which one? 28, 17, 22. We need to get more moolah. We need a million buckaroos. Oh man, this training thing is just crazy to me. This guy's got four strength. This dude. This guy has like crazy stats, man. He's maxed out on speed. He needs to get maxed out on strength too. Number three is cracked. Music's driving me crazy. There's a bazooka. Since this guy doesn't have like any strength at all, this is like easy to, to beat. I don't have to use the, the next level strats on this one. I finished this game on Vita last week. Nice. Where were you on the grind? Now, this is like. This should have been a handheld game for sure. So grind. Oh, that was a shitty start. Oh, I mistimed it. Uh oh. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. Oh my god, I'm not getting a single double. This is really bad. Damn, 
again. I really gotta pay attention to where the other guy is. I need a Bazooka Miracle here. Oh, I mistimed it. Oh, no. Oh, I mistimed it again. Oh, my God. That threw me off hard. How many points do I need? Ten? I've heard this song for only like three minutes. It's already driving me mad, bro. <laughs> three minutes driving you crazy? <sighs> Asked the chat last night, dude. I was playing this like past midnight going insane. I can't even hear the song. I'm so in the zone anyways, but it mind controlled me. <clears throat> oh, his his max damage is three. What? His is two? He must be speed. Number seven, my leader. Oh yeah, he's got high max stats. We gotta bring up his speed too. Number seven's my go-to. <clears throat> we gotta get his stats juiced up. <clears throat> I'm so disappointed that Evo announced Street Fighter Six is the lineup though. Fuck, it would've been so funny if it was Street Fighter V. <clears throat> Street Fighter 6, they have to make an exception, of course. They have to. What do you mean, no one likes Street Fighter 5? Dude, you were the first one to book Capcom Cup tickets, man. You were cheering uh, louder than Kaba. No, my curry! Dun, 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 dun. Try the next level. Catch that. Yummy. Kaba breaks the sound barrier. <laughs> Round three. 
So which whichever is Serbot you make your leader, he gets higher stats. Natural stats. I wonder if there's a way to like optimize that. You probably want it on like a Serbot that doesn't have good high stats. Personally, want a Marvel two over Marvel three? Yeah, but I don't know. How are people gonna practice that? Like, they're all the Marvel two players are like in the U.S. Like Marvel three is worldwide. But even still, those numbers will be small. I'm surprised they put in Mortal Kombat eleven, and they didn't even guys. They didn't even put in DNF. <laughs> the Marvel three came over DNF, dude. Like, holy shit, man. DNF is beyond dead now. Beyond dead. They just got a new palace patch. And a new character. <clears throat> like, that's brutal. MVC3 is a better aiding game. Yeah, aiding themselves recommended it. Forty-three? Oh shit! Another like on Mortal Kombat 11. That's weird. It's just gonna be like a big giant War Street Fighter Six tournament. Oh god, no. What? No bazooka? Where is a bazooka? This guy's ripping me off! Where is the bazooka? Oh my god, no. Oh! Where the hell was the The wizard didn't come to the very end. That was cheap. Oh, that was bad. Super bad RNG. Why did he move to the left like that? I'm gonna twip sweep. Damn it. Suka? No. 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 Uh. Ah! 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 Jesus. I don't. I don't even know. They should have like limited the amount of games at Evo just so they can fit Street Fighter Six in there. <laughs> okay, so no one's talking about State of Play. So guys, State of Play got announced. Sony show this Thursday, so only two days. 
It's at 2 p.m. Thank God. I only got to wake up a little bit earlier. I got a good early sleep pattern going on right now. And it's for their third party developers. Which means ka ching. Ka ching. Yeah, thank God. It's at 2 o'clock. Thank God. Where's my bazooka? No! What the fuck kind of drop was that? Oh shit! Ah! Oh god! Are you playing games on PS5 at Evo? I don't know. That's like a really important question. I'm not sure, but I know the the 120 hertz mode or whatever is on PS5. Pretty sure. I don't know. I don't think it's that expensive to like book a bunch of PS5 stations. I don't. I still don't think we're at the level yet where we're all PC sets because we got so many old games. Shit. That was a bad start. Fudge. from there. Not even close. I wonder if he throws, gets the bazooka after so many, like a specific amount of flips. I wonder if that's how it works. That's the next level of shit. Dude, I wasn't even close. I haven't kept- uh, the problem is we're basing the- the leg off of the beta, you know? So it's like... Can't really go off those numbers right now. Ok, 
Capcom has been listening to the community on input lag and stuff, like, you know, with the PC setups with Capcom Cup and stuff, so it's not like they're not aware of this shit. PS4 version is irrelevant. No, I thought I got the bazooka there. Will I be entering online premieres? Probably. I don't see why not. As long as it as long as it's at decent hours, yeah. Yeah, entering turns will be fun. You know, before it wasn't fun because, you know, online. But now, it'll be fun. We'll see why not. I think it'll be hilarious for you guys to watch me play in a tournament. Where's the bazooka? There it is. Man, this is so hard. Getting 50 is insane. I think I got 53 one time though. It just depends on the timing of the bazooka and all that. Just getting this guy to a three attack is like a nightmare. Shit. Anything else happened today? We also might be getting some Resident Evil 4 news. Actually, we're probably guaranteed to get some Resident Evil 4, like some kind of gameplay trailer. And another thing too, they got VR shit to show, so that means that like... We'll see that Street Fighter VR thing. <laughs> Might get that instead of Street Fighter 6. But most importantly, we might finally get to see Cammy in her pants. Damn. I might have been able to get it there if that idiot wasn't throwing the ball there. Yeah, beta 3. Do you guys think the last beta should be open? Willie has a theory that the last beta could possibly be... Because of Capcom Cup is so serious, right? Maybe they might have an extended beta. Like a beta that lasts all the way until the launch of the game. 
But if they truly want it to be for a competition, then they would need to have all the characters available, which is just not gonna happen, so... Should be close, and go 0 Yeah, I know, I want the 0-3 game so badly. Well, I don't- I don't- I don't think the- the crack is- is that big of a deal, to be honest with you. I don't think it'll affect as much as you guys think it does. I don't think it's a huge deal. Tell me why it's a huge deal. If it had more characters, I would think it's a huge deal, but it doesn't. Yeah, but you're assuming it's gonna be the same game when it comes out, though. It's a... it's a beta. It didn't affect Street Fighter V. You bet your ass people were playing that early. Nice! It didn't count? Oh yeah, it did count. Nice. Street Fighter V sucked. Great argument, Slim. Okay. So he's maxed out now, right? Number 7? Yeah, now we gotta get his speed up. I'm not gonna go all the way with this because this is a nightmare. Yeah, but what I mean is the Street Fighter V, it was the same deal. People got to play it for over a year, right? Some key characters in there that were used <laughs> at EVIL were in the beta, including Nash and Ryu, right? And it didn't affect the game at all. And there were a lot of changes too to Street Fighter V. Like, during the first two weeks, it will matter. But after the two weeks, everyone will be caught up. Like, I don't think you guys understand how fast people catch up by, by watching others. Someone can find out, like, the most optimal combos and setups, and people will copy it within a week. It'll be like doing the work for everyone else. It also depends on who you have to train against, like... It's not like the crack is just like this, everyone's playing Parsec, Parsec across the ocean. And we don't know what Capcom is gonna do. Like I said, there might be an early access, which I wouldn't be surprised at all. And that would even the playing field even more. People already found some optimal stuff on, on the three-day beta. Well, optimal with the current build, yeah. But, like, guys, there's, like, there's only eight characters. I'm telling you, there's so many characters missing. The meta will completely change. Uh, like, what if, you know, Blanca counters Guile and, and uh, Manon and Marisa and Lily and JP and, like, all of a sudden the matchups change and it's like... You know what I mean? You'll, what if you wasted like four or five months on one character and then you have to switch? Like, it's just, there's just so much. What if they change something? What if they change like the cost of, of drive rush and then now you have to do different combos and... It's just... I'm not saying, I'm not saying you shouldn't just play it at all, right? But it's not going to give you this huge massive advantage. It can give you a good feel for the game, which, you know, people can play the, the closed beta and stuff to get a feel for.
you'll have four or five months ahead of someone for for like one week slim that's what i'm saying you're basically doing the work for someone else guys there's tons of players that just joined street fighter 5 recently and are destroying people that have been playing you know street fighter since the street fighter 5 since the beginning Oh, he's got a big uh, red hat. It's kind of distracting. Oh my god, my brain is fried. Just getting his speed to level lunch. two should be fine. See lunch, bro. Oh my god, spaghetti. Spaghetti. Oh, lunch, dude. Spaghetti. Nice. I don't know if I want to go for level three. I don't. I don't, I don't even want to. <laughs> I don't even want to try. It's too much. It's too hard. He's trained enough. Is there anyone else who has really bad speed right now? Seven's at two. Man, his speed was so bad. Number eight. Why the hell did we take number eight? Number nine. Oh man. Number nine's a sniper. Who else do we have? Another sniper, number 25. Strategy 133. Three. Number 37. He's 133? Three. I don't think we can you can build his strength though. See here, because he's got the nerdy glasses. Nerdy glasses means he's not strong. Yeah, it's as strong as he gets. Damn it! So back to number nine. We need to get number nine strength up. Number nine is. Okay, after this, we'll go Puzzle God. But yeah, when, when Street Fighter 6 does come out though, these players do have to hop into the hyperbolic chamber though. They have to go really hard because the time is so limited. You know, like Street Fighter 6 got special privileges because that window is so close for evil, you know? You have like two months. It's fucking go time. Like, say goodbye to your family level shit, you know?
Yeah, hyperbolic time chamber. You're gonna go fucking hard. Oh yeah, the the graph stats. I can. I know I can at least see it uh, before a mission starts. That's all I know. Fuck! I missed the double whammy. Shit. Oh, I didn't see uh, that new Tekken trailer. You should watch it. <laughs> no, I don't want. Actually, I don't want to eat the curry because I'll slow down the timer. It's because you, yeah? Someone ban that guy for spoilers. I love how uh, people that spoil attempt to defend themselves. Like you hear some crazy wild shit like, well everyone already knows. <laughs> it's funny. It's like the most like psychopath shit you'll ever like read. Uh oh, it's not spoilers. <laughs> It's never like a, oh my bad. It's always like some crazy cycle excuse. <laughs> like they'll try to gaslight you. <laughs> oh, his max. Wait, can I, can I go past one? Let's see. It was number nine, right? Yeah, number nine. Damn, that's his max too? Shit. I'm so scared to love the speeds. All right, let's go puzzle god this shit. We did enough training. Our crew is pretty beefy. Let's get these damn cargo containers. Yeah, it's not- it's your fault for not knowing, that's another good one. We're after pearls this time! We're looking at a lot of zenny if we get them all! Pearls. Miss Tron! Are you going to be able to carry everything? Your lift number is really low. Wait, what is our lift number? Hmm. Let's use that crane over there. Oh no, it's a crane. It can only move containers within a certain radius. Uh-oh. But moving them with the crane means we won't have to use the Gustav tank. It's all up to you. I'm counting on you. Uh, Roger, you can depend on me, Miss Tron. That's the chat. You guys are now serve bots. Lift number six. Wait, what the hell's up with this treadmill? Oh no. Oh no, this is gonna be way harder now. There's way more things. Oh, what the fuck is up with this island? And you can't go back? God. 
What's the red box now? Gold! Gold and pearls. Okay. Use the direction button to rotate the crane and the L and R1 buttons to turn it. Press the triangle button to pick up or put down containers. Press the X button to go back. Okay, so I can only grab this crate. And I can put it into the water? And it doesn't take a turn? Interesting. Can I pick it back up? No, I can't. Okay, so another thing I can do is I can drop a crate in its path and grab it that way too. Well, technically we need an island here, so I can grab these pearls here. Five lifts. That's actually a lot of lifts. Oh, there's another crane over here. I just realized that. Stack? Nope. What if I drop this here? Does it go on me? It stops in front of me. This will make a bridge. Oh, and it moves when I move. And I have access to this area. Uh, I can't. I still need to create a bridge because I I can't bring these crates back because of that stupid trend mill on the side. Unless I move that uh, block out of the way. See now with this many variations, I'm sure there's more than one way to do this now. We need the the. Cr well, there is a third crane, you're right. It's over there on the right. How would this crane be useful? There's no wooden crates anymore. You can create, if we can create a bridge on the bottom, that's one way to bring it down. Because I doubt it's something like, uh, burning these guys down here. The, the treadmills, we definitely gotta use those too. It's like, we have to use all the cranes to funnel the crates back here. You know what I mean? We need to bring, bring everything around. Using these treadmills. So I'm gonna assume. Where can I bring this back on this side? I was putting that here useful. Is there a way I can make a bridge over there? There's that one crate I moved at the very beginning. one over here. I've dropped it with the crane. I can get another one. Grabs it over there. And 
places we can. I'm gonna restart this. Fucking kids game, man. Yeah, that guy's over here. So I grabbed it and I dropped it in the water over there. The forklift was fun. The cranes are not fun. The cranes are feels bad, man. I need to see if I can stack a crate on top of the, the box. It creates a path down here, but it doesn't look good. I'll drop it there. Okay, let's see if I'm able to stack two crates on top of each other. I still think the strategy now is to uh, get all these cranes to funnel them back. There's one crate here. And this will make the bridge for me. How would that be useful? Bring with this crane. How would this crane be useful at all? Way too far for 10 steps. Whoops! I didn't mean to grab that. Uh oh. If I drop that, it comes back to me. If I drop this, it follows it towards this bridge, but I don't know. I can't put it here, right? Okay. No metal crates to play with here. No wooden crates. Treadmills. There's other metal crates somewhere. Oh. Oh. Whoops. Oh. When I when I when I pressed right on the D-pad, I thought it would go to like every location and stop at, but no, you gotta press the actual direction. Okay, hold on. Alright. The sun is shining bright now. Sun is shining bright. My eyes are open now. Very bright. I see all the possibilities. I understand now. Oh, 
We might still be screwed. <laughs> we might still be screwed. Uh, Cause I can't get that one over there now. But now I know the rules. Okay, hold on. If I put this on the trend mode, where does it go? Can I, I can't drop it just right in front, right? It'll push it. Pushes it over there. And it's on the square above it, right? Yeah, it is. Right. Okay. The sun is shining. Mm -hmm. So is Street Fighter V done now, or are we going to watch Evil Japan also? Street Fighter V is basically done, yeah. There, There's going to be Evil Japan, but... It's not going to have strong international competition. Like, you know, Capcom Cup, obviously. Fighter Five, but it's okay. It ended off. It ended off great. Ended off with a hoot. Yeah, there's no reason to drop that crate to my right. Just drop it straight up. And it's a party over here. We gotta figure out how to get these two bad boys there in three moves. The problem is we need four moves. <laughs> we need... We need uh, to bring these guys to the spot for the crane to pick them up. And we need to bring them back with our hands. How can this be done in three moves? Wait. Never mind. Wait, ten are we ten away? Hold on. One, hold on. I grab it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, we're good. I think. Yeah. <laughs> no more games. <laughs> Puzzle God! That's the last of the containers! You've got them all! Congratulations! That's the last container! Alright, let's go to the next dock! It was ambitious. Okay! Man, Catcom made some hard puzzles, guys. Oh no, the wooden crate returns. Wait, I'm stuck! What is this madness? Oh no, I'm not. I'm not stuck. The bait. bait. Hold on, there's some... There's already some seriousness at the beginning here. They want me to waste this wooden crate. They're trying to trick me here at the beginning. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Why is there like 50 islands here? What the hell's going on? God, okay, I'll, I'm gonna move this here just because I'm not gonna fall for this. Just 
Is there a crane that can grab this from here? No. Don't question. Just do it. Just feel. Uh, yeah, I don't see any crane that can... There's only three cranes, so... So what, what do you guys think Capcom should do, in your opinion? To maintain the integrity of Street Fighter 6 and now being at EVIL, who knows how much money EVIL is going to be, because it will probably be a premier tournament for Street Fighter 6. What would you guys do? Early access, beta, pre-order only, get early access for a month ahead, like what would you do? Oh, there's another wooden crate here. Can he jump across the water? He can. A little bastard. Don't drop it on my head, please. Is that drop on the bridge then? I can't see where that drops it. Is it gonna drop? Oh no, it's gonna drop in that block. Hmm. Why am I dropping on my head here? Be good. Up or do I want to go down? Up or down? Up or down? Uh. <laughs> oh, I can create the bridge here. <gasps> no! Wait. Yes. No. No, yes. Yes. No. Yes? No. Cat comes already screwed. <laughs> uh, why is Catcom screwed? The players are screwed. <laughs> what the hell is this crane for? Another bridge over here, but why? Why? Why would making a bridge there be useful? How the hell am I going to get these crates back? It's like 50,000 steps. No matter what, I have to use the crane to bring these boxes back. Let's see here. If I grab this bad boy... Oh shit, it's going to land on my head. Fudge. So you're making it sound like this the the cracked beta was like intentional was intended by Capcom. Oh, I'm one away. I'm one away. Would making the bridge here be better? Maybe I do take the bait and put the wooden crate in. Let's see. Take your damn crates and we'll see. I'm confused, Vesper. Is this the whole game? No, it's this game is like. 
I can't explain it. It's a bunch of different mini games combined into one. So there's action missions like Mega Man Legends. There's uh, like an RPG mode where you're like stuck in a maze. And then there's like puzzle missions like this one. And we're reaching the harder levels of these missions. You don't have to play this. Like if you don't like puzzles, you don't have to play this at all. I do. So that's why I'm playing it. I'm playing them all. And we're on the harder levels of it. It's like a bunch. It's like it's not like Kirby All Star because it's all the same game with a bunch of missions. There's a mother base element where you can level up all these serve bots. There's a lot to this game. It's it's taking us a while to get used to. There is a lot going on. Okay, let's check the steps here. One, two. Alright. Yeah, now I should be able to do it. So maybe the supposed to use the wooden crate. Maybe I played myself at the start. Let's find out. Yeah, now we have enough space. So is there any way I can make a bridge here at this point? If I grab that, I can put the crate there. This bad boy, I can't get him to do anything. How many steps do we have? Two? Wait, there's only two steps left? How is that possible? How can there only be two? I need the gold as well. How? How are you supposed to do that? Oh no, guys, there's some next level shit to this. Maybe the bridge was here all along. Hmm. This one's tough. This one's tough. It doesn't want me to waste many turns getting across here. Perhaps there's a way I can get across if I go like this. Hold on. There's another way to do this. Put your ass in that crane. What if I drop it here? Is that useful to me? Now I have access to this area here. I got seven turns left. But how do I get these bad boys back home? What crane can help me get these guys back home? Vesper, what do you what do you think would be hard? Solving puzzles or creating the puzzles itself? I always think about that. I was thinking about that last night. I'm like, man, how much time would it take to create the puzzle, you know? To have it designed in a way where you have to grab everything in a very specific order. Makes my brain hurt. There's nowhere this crane can put these boxes to help me get it home, right? There's only here. Yeah, it's only the second square across. I can grab them from here. That's in the river. That's in the river. How do I get you, How do I get you home? How do I get you home? Even if I made the bridge way over there. Get that Serba out of there. He's going to hurt someone. Oh, he only follows my instructions. It's completely safe. Okay. 
See, now this one's blocked off. Fuck, this is a mess, man. This is a mess. I thought the... And what is the point of this crane over here? What does this crane do? It can create another bridge, but why would we want another bridge? It also can grab a box over there. Why? Why would we need that? It just doesn't make sense to make a bridge over there. Guys, we're not- there's- We're stealing- we're stealing, uh... The crates. We're not- we're not shipping them out to where they're supposed to go, guys. We're pirates. See, this made the most sense. Like, me doing the next level bridge here. We just, we're down to three turns if we do it this way. See, now that we, we got this path cleared, now we have room to work with. Now I can grab this. Bring this bad boy over here. Take him home. What? Why can't I take him home? What? <laughs> Wait, all oh, right. Whoops, that was the wrong one. Come on, screw it up. Uh... I can get it, no. Now I can take it. Wow, well, why is it, why wasn't DNF at the evil lineup? What happened? Whoops! Someone went one too far, I was talking shit. Oh, damn it, man! What the f I can't see shit! Maybe there's something in here, a secret item. What? What did he give me? What the hell was that? I was just kidding. I didn't know there was an item in there. Where are you going, little guy? Oh, he got pancakes. Shit, I should have known something. You can't- can you get them to lift you up? Oh my god, if you could, I was about to lose my mind. Wait, I, I gotta make sure.
Oh my god. If that if that was the case, I would have been like my brain would have melted. How the hell am I supposed to do this in three steps, bro? I need like six steps from here. Maybe even seven just to get these guys back home. This is fucking crazy. God, this one is pain. This is pain, little servbot. Pain. Well, one thing is clear, it wants me to waste no steps, like, physically getting across. Like, this starting is crucial. Oh my god. So there's one bridge here we can make. This doesn't make to give us anything. So it makes sense to put this here. What else can I manipulate from here? Oh, you know, I can get to the island from that way too. Does that help me though? I don't know if that's useful. I'll show you guys what I mean. So I can get this crate, like this. Fuck, stop telling me how to use the damn crane every time I use this crate. So I drop it like this, instead. And then I grab this. Oh, never mind. Never mind, I fucked up. I thought I was one step closer to the boat. I was about to make the bridge across from the other island, but no. Can't do that. How do I get these guys back home? That's the thing. This piece of shit is so far away. Look how far this guy is. He's on another planet. I would have to put him like... Oh, that's maybe what the top crane is for to get this piece of shit back. Maybe. See, now we're up we're stuck here. How do I get these guys? How do I get this guy home? This bomb crane doesn't help. Carry it. Can I go back that way? Oh, if I put that one there, maybe I could, though. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this one is so painful. This one hurts so hard, man. Uh, can I, uh, I can trash all the Zon shit I've been collecting? Yeah, you can, Zach. You can if you want. If I would've bit the bug on D2, I would've bit it by now. I'm having too much fun yelling at spaghetti and, uh, lifting crates. made you collect it for nothing I mean you guys can sell it I 
you been on this once since you started? No, no, we were training in, in the gym and getting all the serve bots up and stuff. We're just kind of like grasping the situation. You want curry rice now? Yeah? Okay, see, so doing that allows me to bring these crates back here. And I got a wooden crate. And now I can't get across the bridge. Let's see here. Oh, are you making fun of me? Okay, uh, do I have enough turns to bring this one back? exactly the right amount of steps which is suspicious very suspicious okay I think now we're in a better position now we have four turns now got a lot to work with here now. Okay, guys. Four turns to get three crates back. But how? Can I bring this back in ten? <gasps> the exact amount. Very suspicious. Very suspicious. Three to bring back bring back two. But I can... Oh, I can't bring back the gold. I want the gold. What is the point of this crane? Why is there a crane up here, guys? Why? What is its purpose? Is there a purpose? To taunt me? Why is there a crane here? To move stuff? Holy shit. You guys really are server bots. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, no, no. I thought maybe. Wait. Wait. wait? Wait. Hold on. Oh no. Oh my god. I think I figured it out. I think I got it. Holy shit. Galaxy brain stuff incoming. <gasps> Holy shit. Please. Please. Please, on my knees. Please be enough. <gasps> the puzzle god. That's the last container. Yes. All right, let's go to the next dock. Okay. That one was devastating. Shark. What was the top crane for? It was a red hearing. Dude, the starting with the wooden crates was brutal. I was like second guessing myself like right. Wait a second, what? The gold is here. For free. Guys, I don't feel so good. Why are they giving me the gold for free? Ten lifts on this one? Hold on. This is too easy. Something's off. I don't feel so good. There's no crane here. There's no trick. It's just there for the taking. It's like if you made it this far, they give you a free gold crate. Get your ass in there. 
I want the forklift back. Oh, I missed the forklift. The forklift was fun. Hey, Vesper, loved your Metroid Fusion playthrough. Something about playing Nintendo games, always uh, always those streamers riot with backseating. <laughs> yeah. You noticed, hey? It's okay. I'm used to it now. Vesper loves Game Boy Advance. There's a lot of good games in the Game Boy Advance that have no business being on it. That 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 console or that uh, handheld does not deserve the games that are on it. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I know. I noticed the ten lifts. I'm scared too. Okay, I'm just looking at the crane. There's this 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 box right here is also sus. If I make the bridge to this pearl, then it screws everything up. But if I don't make it to it, then how do I get it? There's no crane that can that can uh, grab it from here. Ten lifts, guys. Let's just see what happens. Right? Let's just work it out. That's all we can do. Can't be afraid. Can't be afraid. What's Golden Sun? What's Golden Snooze? Guys, there'll be a ton of games for you guys to be excited about at State of Play. It's the third parties. It's a Nintendo RPG. I thought their only RPG is uh, Fire Emblem. It's the RPG game of Game Boy Advance. This crane can't do anything. Oh, I can grab this one. But why? To make a bridge, that's why. It's turn-based? Now you have my full attention. I'm not gonna lie though, guys. Um, Cause we were playing that, you know, curry, rice, spaghetti, a lunch last night and uh, it, it reminded me of Final Fantasy IX, which made me really want to play some Final Fantasy IX. And then, it also reminded me of Final Fantasy X2, but I didn't want to tell you guys because, like, there's some dark memories there. Where me and Qua played X2 right to, like, we were, like, 90% done the game, <laughs> but ran into some issues. And then I was, like, really jonesing to play Final Fantasy X2 for some reason. I don't know. This is what happens when I, when you don't play JRPGs for so long, I'm starting to get like, I don't know, weird thoughts. Any comments on tonight's evil announcement, Vesper? Uh, yes, I got a few comments. One, I'm sad Street Fighter V is not evil this year. It would have been hilarious. Two, uh, where's DNF? Three, uh, no one plays Marvel 3, four, no one plays Mortal Kombat 11, and five, uh, how do you practice KOF 15 if there's no matchmaking, and six, uh, I don't know if I have a six. Instead of calling it evil, they should just call it Street Fighter 6 2023. Because they're not going to have enough space for the other games if everyone's entering Street Fighter 6. And that's pretty much all I have to say. What do you guys have to say about it? We got five lifts. And three crates. That means we got to do this in two turns. Now, we didn't need to use the, the treadmills last time. And they're leading down. Suspiciously. Okay, if they go here, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Suspiciously. These treadmills. Wait, how do I... 
How do we even get this fucking pearl? Let's be real, nobody plays DNF. I mean, yes, it's true that no one <laughs> plays DNF, but it's a newer game, and it would be... Like, is Mortal Kombat 11 still have enough players? You know? I don't know. I don't know what the hell's going on. Wait, how do I grab that? How do I grab that pearl? Guys, how do I grab the pearls? I can't grab that one. It's, it's right next to the treadmill. The only way is to create a bridge. the fuck this is all messed up okay. carefully <laughs> wait 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 Did I fuck up? <laughs> Shit! No, no, I didn't. I didn't fuck up. Come on. The only way I can get it is going this way. Oh, fuck. How many turns do I have left? That's the only way I can grab it, right? That's the only way. How do I get that one? What the fuck is that location? What? There's... These pearls are in messed up spots. How the hell do I get that one? It's fucked. I only have two turns. I ha I need two just to get this piece of shit. Vesper did not plan ahead. <laughs> God, this one looks rough. This one looks rough, boys. This one looks rough. What? Wait, 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 wait. I'm starting to see the big picture. I'm starting to see it. My eyes. They've come to full focus now. That has to be it. That's the only way I get this piece of shit home. It's the only way. It's the only combination. Get your ass in that crane. And then this has gotta go down. Yes. See? I see it, guys. I see it. Four steps left. And only two crates. Four steps. What do we do? 
What do we do, guys? I can put down two... I could put down two wooden crates. We need two steps to get this, this crane. Hold on. This is gonna be some next level shit again here. And it won't let me get up there. Or will it? Or will it? Oh. I think I can send a, a wooden crate back here. Why would I want to do that? Wait, 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 Three steps to get back one crate. I think I got it. It's easy peasy now, right? One, two. I don't got it. I don't got it. Hold on. Right? No. Hold on. One. Hold on. Put one here. That's one lift. I take the second. I'm down to one more lift. No, can't do it. I need four turns just to get this piece of shit. There's no other way I can grab it without making a two block bridge, right? There's no other way. It's in the dumbest spot ever. I, I swear this is... Can you grab it while you're going by the, the, the treadmill? I think so. If only it let me like, come across. There's no way to get this one turn. God, we're so close. Your team was, uh, Cable, Iron Man, Mega Man? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that team is... ...pretty reckless. You definitely need an anti-air assist with a team like that. <laughs> I guess you could use Cable. That'd be a whack anti-air assist, though. Fuck, dude. I need so many turns for that one crate. Why? 
If only I had enough turns to bring it back. Oh my god. Damn it, dude! I could bring it back if I don't throw the gold. That's that's the tease. I could have brought it back if I didn't throw that gold crate in there. But no. It wants me to do something beyond. What does it want me to do? Can I target it this way? Maybe this is bait. Maybe. Maybe I drop this here and then I can get across somehow. It seems so obvious you put it here. And then I use the wooden crate instead. Let's see. This helps me somehow. So I do it backwards. How does this help me though? Now I have no wooden crates to get that other one. Uh, Vesper, are you gonna change how the give sub thing works before Street Fighter 6 comes out? Like, say someone gives a hundred subs, maybe that could get annoying. <laughs> You're saying when Street Fighter 6 comes out, people are just gonna give me non-stop 100 gift bombs? <laughs> I, I think you can, you can just, you can turn it off. I just don't know how to. But you can like, you can parry them. Eris does it all the time. I don't know how to do that. Sword Sword already has an account loaded for it. Jesus Christ, guys. First off, guys, how am I supposed to sustain my addiction? All right, if I disable subs. <laughs> That's like the first thing we have to consider. I, I don't know. I, I'll look it up, okay? I'm, I can't believe you guys are thinking about that right now. That's like the least of our problems. See what I'm talking about? <laughs> Sword is ready. <laughs> See what I'm talking about, man? Next time you guys talk to me about this shit, talk to me about it like behind closed doors. Don't like say that shit in public. It's like an old version that allows purring. There's gotta be a way. There has to be a way, dude. I'll, I'll look it up, okay? I just have to remember. But I'll look it up. <laughs> you guys are afraid of sword. Jesus. Okay, guys, we're in a worse situation now. Now we have two turns instead of three. So we fucked up. Wait, did we fuck up? Yeah, we definitely. But I want to see if I can grab this thing on the trend bill. So let's find out. <laughs> Sorry, thanks so much for the 10 bomb, dude. Appreciate it. Thanks so much, dude. Did I miss your sub, Nero? I hope I did, dude. Thanks, Nero, as well, for the 26. No, I can't grab the crate one. Just I can't just do a drive-by grab. Mm. 
Yeah, the MK mythology was that was a godlike place for it. Dude. So now we're down to the situation again. Same situation. could put a block like stop it from touching the treadmill that's like the only way i don't know how to bring it home guys how do i bring this one home it's in such a stupid spot I think this is the optimal way to do it, I just think that whatever is left is not optimal. Unless we can just somehow bring it home, but no, that's, that's tank. There's no way. We're not even close. Only this crane can just grab this bad boy. <gasps> Wait! No way! No way! No way! I didn't even think about that! Oh my god, that is fucking insane! Oh my god, that didn't even cross my mind! Oh my god, I feel so bad for the kids that play this game. Holy shit, it didn't even cross my mind. I didn't even think about that. Oh my god, dude. That's fucking crazy! I didn't even- it didn't even cross my mind to do that. Okay, let's head back to the castle shaft. Holy shit, what a puzzle. That one was fucking crazy. That puzzle was awesome. It was killing me seeing you so close last time? Yeah. I, I, I was, I'm glad I put myself in a desperate situation, right? Because I would never have just thought of trying that. Damn, man. You solved the baby game, I know. 
Oh my god. 420. Oh, we got enough. We got a million now, don't we? And we got the gold containers. Yeah, we got a million zenny. Brought back a rain refractor ore. Oh, we got another item. And an e-bottle. Torture room? What the hell? Torture room? Oh no! <laughs> Who's in the torture room? I'll be right back. Looks like there's a lazy serve bot somewhere. Oh, someone got number four sloth. All right, what should we do first? Let's appraise. Uh, God, look how many rooms there are now in this game. God. Why don't we have to appraise the bottles? Uh, never got juice before. Who likes that? 3,000 zenny for a ring? Oh my god, what's going on with the subs today? Oh no! Wait! <laughs> Legend, you're the one who was concerned about gift subs and now you're giving me 10 gift subs. What the fuck? <laughs> He's testing me? There's like a thing you can like disable it somehow. I'm pretty sure. I have to look it up. It's a very common thing to like stop giant gift bombs. Right? Anyways, thanks so much for the 10 bomb guys. Thanks, Sword, and he's a legend. Thanks so much. Appreciate it. I don't know. I don't think this uh, sub notification gets old. <laughs> I'm sure if we listened to it a hundred times in a row, it wouldn't be so bad. This can be used to reduce development costs. Oh, okay. Oh, maybe I can get a discount on that giant armor. Alright, let's go to the lab. I Man, I can reduce the volume on it a little bit. I can tweak that. Okay, let's uh, talk. Give this guy. I don't have anything to give him? Oh, you just use it when you buy something? Uh. Oops. Uh. Oh, no. Oh. Back up one. Develop. Armor. Oh, so you can use it. Good, good thing I waited. Oh my god. It reduces it by 10%. Okay. Good thing I waited. Okay. 
We'll build this. Hard armor. We spent a million zenny. Or 900,000. The hard armor I made is the strongest armor anywhere. I have nothing left to do. My life is complete. I feel wonderful. <laughs> wow. Number 34's life is complete. That's cool. That's awesome. All right. Uh, oh, oh God! E tank seven or five hundred thousand. God. Okay. Um. Hold on. Do I have all the bottles right now? Two, three, four. We have no more ones. Let's see what the hard armor says. It reduces damage to a quarter. I wouldn't sell it if I were you. Reduces damage by a quarter. Or two a quarter. Is this it two a quarter? Or by a quarter? I think it's two a quarter. I want this. Just so I have a full collection. Alright. Uh, what else can we do? Oh, yeah, we gotta see this new room, right? The torture room. Who do we have to interrogate? There's one guy in here. Number 20. This room has a lot of interesting looking equipment in it. It gives me goosebumps just thinking about what you might be able to do with it. I think I'll be spending a lot of time in here. Um, if you say so. <gasps> He's a sadist. Number 20. PUNISH?! Select a Servbot to punish? Oh, cause he's number 4 Sloth, right? Number 36. He's the, the music guy. Hold on, let me, let me talk to him first. Be in Tron's room. Professor, what do you think of Tron's assist in MVC3? Did she still have a good assist in MVC3? It's tragic they got rid of her bugged assist, though. That was like one of her main things. I'll write a song for you. He doesn't say anything. Let's punish him. That's crazy, Tron tortures the serve bots if they get too lazy. Do you want an explanation of the torture room rules? Yes. Use the torture room's tools to reduce the serve bot's sloth rating to zero in 30 seconds. Spikes, flame jets, wait. Okay. Please forgive me, Miss Tron. No, I'm gonna teach you not to goof off. Are you ready? <laughs> Go! <laughs> what? What is this sick shit? <laughs> oh! Uh. Oh, that slows him down. Uh. Uh. Well, have you learned your lesson? What do you think you're doing? I could have been killed. Wasn't cured of his laziness. Do you want to punish another servo? Yes, we need to punish him again.
Uh, no! Oh, he was moving so fast. I won't goof off again, I promise. 36 laziness has been cured. Everyone is working hard. <laughs> All right. Oh, I should have made number 20 the leader. Everyone is working hard. Right. That's crazy. Vesper is imagining when I take too long to finish artwork. Yeah, I throw Luke in there. <clears throat> Get my new sub notification. All right. Uh. We got armor. Let's do some more missions, I guess. Send some more scouts out. What's up with number eight? Eight looks useless, but he doesn't have his, his power. Evan's got good stats. Two, one, two. Clumsy. I want to do more Puzzle God missions. Alright, mission one, we got that. Hold on. We haven't went to mission four in a while, but we haven't got any new things except for armor. That's all of them. They're all level three now, right? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go explore the runes a little bit more. Get some more equipment. I want to get some better weapons. And the puzzle container mission three is eight hundred thousand zenny. I can't even imagine how hard the puzzles must be. I think pressing either a triangle or square shows the stats. Okay. So it's showing that number one is maxed out in stats, right? On everything. So we got one to seven. All their stats are good. And we took out 8 and put in 9 instead. 11's got really good stats too, but he's he's got no brains. This guy's a sniper. I think I could... Oh wait, did it, this guy reach his maximum strength? He didn't reach his maximum speed. Who else is good at good, good stats? Jogs on the deck every morning except when it's cold. He's got really good, well-rounded stats, too. Wait, we only- oh, right. What? I thought it was, uh, eight serve bots. Okay, then we're good then. So you can check it on that list. Okay, one second, let's see here. Damn it! I pressed triangle and it brought up that other menu. I'll try square. No, it's not doing anything. You're talking about on this list, right? Oh, circle maybe?
this one. Oh, there we go. Speed. Number seven speed, yeah. He has like full max stats except for brain, right. Okay, now I understand. So number four, we can bring up one speed, which I'm, I'm not gonna play that stupid mini game ever again. <laughs> number seven though, my god, maybe we'll bring up number seven. I'm so fucking scared, number seven. So number 10's got good stats. Number 11. Number 12 is pretty cracked too. Number 22. The in the engine room. He's crazy. But it also depends on their special abilities, not just their stats themselves, you know? Well, at least we got super powerful armor now. And our health bar is quite big now, too. We don't have no, like, jet move Sir, thing. Come back here when you want to go back to the get -to They still won't let me go back. To that, uh, area. That Tizo couldn't blow up that wall. <laughs> Go find some bosses, I guess. Should be able to one shot like everything in here. to the extreme right. I think that's where we left off. I'm trying to remember. Right, we blow up in this wall. They designed this map in a way where you can kind of quickly catch up to where you left off. Now we go this way. Now, did I go down this hall? to find out. The money's not even like worth the pick up in this game because you get so much for completing the missions. So there's a chest. Not right. And here. Wait, didn't this lead isn't this the part that led to the boss room? Pretty sure it was. I'll pop the sand just in case it is the boss room. 
Oh, it's not. <clears throat> what we got in there? A brain cube. Excellent. Which is like the easiest stat to level up. Anything else in You guys are saying I like mechs now? It's a serious accusation. I don't like slander in the chat. Okay, let's go south. There's like this big bottom path, and we got this up here. Oh, what's this? What's the next game we're playing after this? I think a Castlevania game? And then a res game. And then uh, we'll see where we go from there because remember we might get Street Fighter 6 news and then I'll see how busy I'm gonna be, but... I mean, I shouldn't be so busy, like I'll still be streaming. Full circle. There's a suspicious square room in here, too. Maybe yeah, we came from here. Maybe this top part's the one that leads to the boss room? I don't- I don't know what the next one is. I have to- it's, uh, the next Game Boy Advance one, though. I wish they could play Tomb Raider 2. <laughs> oh, we're definitely here. Oh. Excuse me. <coughs> I was definitely here before because that chest is open. Vesper, you can play Tomb Raider 2. <laughs> I could, yes. Oh, that's where this boss guy is. Okay. And everything's getting destroyed by me now. Didn't I flush Apex? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not playing. I'm. I'm doing some dailies like with Hennessy, but I'm only playing like two games of Deathmatch and then. That's all I need to get the rewards for the anniversary or whatever. Or so he says. <laughs> no guys, there's nothing... Like, the new season's good, but it's not enough to bring me back. And the, and the, the team deathmatch is awesome, but it's not competitive. Like, there's no ranked, right? So there's nothing for me that nothing there for me to get addicted. So you guys should not be concerned. Everyone can relax. Okay, this was definitely in the boss room for sure. Pop this in just in case it forces me to restart.
Whatever you say, B dog. What the hell, guys? Don't you guys trust me? I've been clean for 13 months. And I hopped- I got back on the wagon instantly. You guys need to relax. The character needs a dash. Because we're that traumatized by Apex. I've never seen such hate for Octane. High Octane action. <clears throat> How do we get to this square room in here, though? We gotta look around, there might be a spot on the wall. That looks sus. <clears throat> Best friend, I don't think you understand how the chair works. We relaxed if you relaxed. What's that supposed to mean? I'm not relaxed. I only hate Apex. I listen to all your rants. At least the rants were constructive with suggestions. There's a tree here. Why is there a tree here? That's suspicious. What happens if I lift it up? Damn, I should've got those guys to, uh, the Cerebots to examine them. Oh man, my Cerebots are so strong now too, I didn't even realize. They're throwing bombs and everything. They're juiced. Oh yeah, look at the deeps now. I like the slingshot too. They're scared of the torture room. <laughs> They've been training hard. There's water here. Hopped in the pond. Whoa! Fountain of youth. What? Those are red too. Those are an insane amount of money. What is this? Fear is a great motivation. Yeah. What's more important, guys? Loyalty 
or obedience. <laughs> Oh, what? I can't go any further. Damn it. I need this flying thing. Oh, there's a chest right in front of me. How did I not see that? Old instrument. I'm telling you guys. We're getting... Whatever it is, we're, we're, our next thing is the fly. Alright. There's no boss though, I get the second piece. You know, if you really want to 100% this game and just grind everything, this game is way longer than Mega Man Legends 1, hey? They could have made this their own spin-off series too. And just evolve the whole mother base aspect, but I really do feel like this game would have been better as a handheld game. Because of its nature of like... The puzzles and all that, you know? It'd be a cool game to, like, try to solve a puzzle while you're on the bus. Did I go here already? I did, that's at least the other side of the chest. <clears throat> There's nothing left? What? There's no way I explored this whole area. There's no way. There's this square room in the middle. That's what's tripping me out. There's nothing left. This leads to the boss. And that's it. That's crazy. How could that be it? There's nothing to go above to get to that center room. I search this too. Yep. Yeah. I search that bottom room. Pretty sure. Double check to make sure. Because there's there's supposed to be a a hidden tier thing or whatever, right? That's what Tizo was looking for in the first place. I guess we got to that fountain with tons of money, but it wasn't was no tier. Yeah, this is what led to that fountain. And that up here leads to the chest. Hmm. Maybe that instrument like opens up a hidden door or something. That's like the next step, maybe. That's bullshit. That's some Zelda one shit. Kino. That's baloney. feel about that. And this way is blocked off by two spots? There's the 
chest. Oh yeah, they can grab that from the hole. And then this is the shortcut to the boss. Here. There's a hint on the map. I mean, that's how I figured it out, but it broke the rule. The broken wall had no, like, crack on it. That's bullshit. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Hey, there's a crack right here. I never noticed that. What the fuck? So some other crazy area. Other like there's gonna be stuff to break here too, because you can see on the map. It's guarded. Guarded treasure. Take this! Okay. Okay, let's see if there's something to break on this wall here. Curious. Oh, nothing on this side. On this side. Now the game left me paranoid? Well, I see the... You know, the walls are close. I'm just making sure that they're not pulling the same trick again. Did I say anything about the floor? I guess that does technically lead to this spot. There's nothing I can break here. And you guys are right, it did make me a little paranoid. Now that I know... Yeah, we definitely explored this whole area. I'm gonna watch that Tekken 8 trailer on stream. Yeah, we can watch it. Trap detection on doors. Paranoia. There's, a, there's another empty room here. There's an empty room floating here. That's gotta mean something, right? Check this. This is bullshit. Hmm, this 
this leads to a dead end. Ouch. Wow, is that Tekken trailer really good? I'm gonna watch it once I get back to base. That's another really huge hint that Capcom's gonna announce something to stay to play, right? Why would Tekken just randomly show off a character after Capcom Cup, you know? The timing is impeccable. It's like, it's so blatant that Capcom's gonna be a stay to play. Check it out in 4K. I don't know if my internet can handle that. Let's go up this path here. Go around. What do you mean I'm the Lord of Conspiracies? It's it's called deduction. I take all the information, and then you can s yeah. Zach, did you did you get rid of all of my Amazon gear? Hmm. Chilling in the bank. What, which pieces were you missing for the Mavina set? The... the Tierra, probably? Yeah. Interesting. No, it's, it's tempting. It's tempting, but... Ah, man. I'm just jonesing for a JRPG right now. Badly. I really want to do some like once I finish the the last step upstairs. I really want to do some late night like overtime streams and play some JRPGs. Vesper tur turbo chill streams. Wait, this is the room? Oh, we already found this room. Ugh. Status. Oh, you can actually look at the Gustav from here. The speed's not maxed out. So, what what happens if you put in a different Serbot instead of a Sniper? What does that mean? Like, what is it? how does it change the attack? What the fuck is Golden Sun? <laughs> it's a great game. I don't know. You guys are saying how you don't trust me? I don't trust you guys either. Especially when it comes to Nintendo games. Grandia? I've only played Grandia for the, the Dreamcast, that Dreamcast one. It was awesome. Never heard of this series. I should play the original. Learn what it takes to be a Geo Hound. Curry, rice, spaghetti. A lunch. B lunch. got two items. It was worth the trip. Charlie, do you want to go back to the ghetto shop? Yes. Let's head back home, boys. Roger! <clears throat> hmm. 
Uh, rusted tank and old instrument. No brains. We got brain cubes. <gasps> oh no, we got a lazy servbot, guys. A discipline. Uh oh. You know what that means. Anyone to give any brains here? Yeah, his brains went up. More brains? Number 11 is getting super smart. Alright, we need the discipline. Straight to the torture room. <clears throat> punish. Who are we punishing? Number 34? I got a number 34. He's a, he was in the lab. No, I'm gonna teach you not to goof off. Take that. No! Oh, you little bastard. Mm. Get the spice. Uh, God. Well, have you learned your lesson? I won't goof off again. Laziness has been cured. Good. Everyone's working hard. Right, let's get these items appraised. So we got this rusted tank. Oh, E bottle? No more E bottles, please. Old instrument. He might write a song about it. Oh, we already know exactly where to go. It's that la the first sloth. The dude on the piano. This is an ancient musical instrument. We found it in Nakai runes. The ancients must have listened to music just as we do. An ancient lost civilization. I wonder what it was like. I'll write a song about it. Okay. Made the background music ancient runes. You can hear this song inside uh, the Gizo shaft is strong. If you want to change the background music, tell me. Okay. Talk to him. Oops. Oops. Uh. All right, I'll change the music. Didn't change. Maybe it's somewhere else. <clears throat> oh, it did change. <laughs> Professor, where where is Metroid Prime Remastered? Well, right now there's another Nintendo game people are talking about. This Golden Sun or Golden Snooze or whatever the hell it's called. Try giving this to someone. Give rusted tank. Let's give you the rusted tank. How about you? How about you? There we go. 
What do you think of that? It may be a little rusty, but it's still pretty good. You bet our science can't duplicate this technology yet. But if we repair it, we should be able to attach it to the Gustav. It won't make the Gustav too heavy or anything, will it? No. I wonder what the ancients used to make these. Well, let's give it a try. There. Yi Tang Pi Gustav part. What's that do? The Gustav's maximum energy rating has gone up. This means you should have less to worry about in battle. We'll attach it right away. Nice. Develop that shit. Oh, we get it automatically? Even better. E Tank 7. Oops. There's nothing more we can do, Mistron. <laughs> Maximum power. I can't make any bigger bottles. Damn, we're like all juiced out now. Except on weapons. Do you want to hear? Oh. Alright, we already talked to him about that. I can't believe that's it. We're as strong as we're gonna get. Send out my trusty scouts. Stand them in the middle of nowhere. Oh yeah, you guys said you want to watch that Tekken trailer? Check. I'm all ears now! <laughs> I can't do that shit. I wish I could. <laughs> oh my god. Streaming should set up games should it nerf its visuals over it? Well, the there one way that you can deal with it is you can do the 936p tech, right? Maybe the Tekken streamers gotta they gotta bring it down a notch. Download more bit rates. Alright, back to mission one. We're going full circle. I wanna do more puzzles. Here we go. Don't tell me we're gonna Remember, rob the pet store. It's a pet store again? Oh, where are we? Wait a minute. What happened to the bridge? It's been destroyed! <laughs> Sorry, we didn't know. But we were finally going to make it right this time, too. The police must be getting smarter. Still, we came here to do a job, and we're going to do it! Move out! Roger! Wait, okay, they took out the bridge, but we can fly! Can't we just get that ship to, to fly us over? Go around the destroyed bridge and get to the bank. What the fuck? Why is everyone so stupid? We have so much health now. Oh my god, the, the police are already here! What are they doing to that tree? Oh, there's apples. Of course. Whatever they send them on this guy. Can they can they latch onto this thing? 
Oh, they can throw bombs at it. My servos are so powerful. Don't raid that house before we destroy it. <laughs> We're so powerful. Oh, they're just slowing it down for me. What's shooting me? Oh, shoot. Oh, there's a guy in there! What the hell? Oh, not anymore. Everything is getting one shot. Oh, they had cake too? Oh, they're trying to barricade us. Stop them. Nice try. What about this mailbox? What are they getting me? What is that? Paper? The thing is, you're supposed to. This mission is like, uh. You get all these assorted parts for discounts on uh, development costs. Every mission kind of has its own little role, you know? Where's that chief... chief police officer? Oh, what? He's got a gyrocopter. I guys, is a gyrocopter like a real life thing, or is it a high fantasy thing? Oh, there's something you can steal from this. Let's see if we can latch on this. The hunt is on. Get them, guys. Oh, they're not fast enough. It's real, but highly inefficient. I could imagine, yeah. It's like trying to make a motorcycle, but as like for air travel. Probably more efficient to like create a better, a more efficient jetpack or something. You know? There's those thingies, those one man uh, machines in, in Metal Gear. Wow, this guy has an impressive amount of health. Drones? Aren't drones really expensive though? No? Oh, they keep spawning. Oh, there's the bank. I didn't know that.
Drones are pretty scary. Oh, she has got the the aliens mech. All right, that's as far as you get. Your time's up. <laughs> my my, what a big robot you have! <gasps> Wherever did you find it? <laughs> I had to get special permission from the captain to buy this. I guess that means you'll be in big trouble if you don't capture me, won't you? Tell me about it. Wait, why am I talking to you about this? <laughs> That's enough out of you. You're under arrest. Oh my gosh, she's throwing crates at me. Oh my god, look how much damage we do to her. Okay, we gotta rob the bank first, though. Last time we made this mistake. Nothing else. Why are they saying yay? Oh my god, the poor bank. Oh yeah, the safe. Doesn't the Serbot get the giant combination? Oh wait, no, I think we need to defeat her now. She's got a giant baton! We're way too powerful now. This is free! We did it, guys! I don't know why they keep restoring these banks okay, of money, boys. but... Make sure you get all of it! Yes, this one! This poor town, being terrorized. Oh no, she's gonna get fired for sure now. Oh, why uh -oh. can't I ever win? What's gonna happen when the captain finds out? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I'm sorry, ma'am. What? But I'm sorry, ma'am. <laughs> but I mean, I'm sorry. Would you please reconsider? Uh oh. Hmm. Looks like she's in a lot of trouble. Recruit her. I feel kind of sorry for her. Miss Tron, we got everything. Let's go home. I'm sorry, but I've got my own problems to worry about. Good luck, officer. <laughs> she just ditches her. She's done so. Wow, she just leaves her. That's horrible. This wasn't for kids. Gold. 400,000 for that. Wow, curry. Found a bunch of food. He got her fired. We don't know if it was necessarily getting fired. She just said to reconsider. <laughs> Maybe she got like, I don't know, suspension. We got loader parts from the police officer's robot. Loader parts. This game makes kids into men? I don't know, I just feel bad. She's just doing her job, and she has inferior, like, technology. It increases your maximum energy. Extra energy tank. Here we go, loader parts. Alright, let's check that out. Head to the lab. I thought this guy's life is complete. 
some of them here. Let's try them anyways. Two? No, no one in here can take it. Oh no. Who do I give the loader parts to? Uh, we can head to the cafe and talk to that one dude. Maybe he might know. Number 39, he likes poems. Smarts and brains, number 19 seeks wisdom. Look how hard he trains. These guys all seek wisdom. Ten is looking for a part for the goods off an item. Yes, he's smart. Hurry, give it to him. Number ten. Uh, where's number ten? It said song. The appraisal guy said song. Oh, did he? Oh. I must have misread it then. Ah, thanks. I didn't realize it said song. This is a piece of the robot that the rookie police officer was using. Rookie police officer? Hmm. I made a new song using her as the subject. Police lady music. Okay. okay, let's change the music to police lady. So is there is there a level four? Mission one rank level zero. So what does that mean? There's nothing left for us to take here. No, oh, it's over. Mission ones are over. No more police lady. Now I'll never know what happened to her. That story is over forever. Alright, mission two. Is it puzzle time, boys? Container puzzles and no stupid cranes and forklifts. Just pure raw skill. Level 3 puzzle difficulty though, I'm scared. Hold me. There we go. The ultimate challenge. Get some color TVs. Color TVs. Oh my God! Television sets. He's trying. Look over there. The ground's moving. <laughs> That's called a conveyor belt. They're common in places like this. You'll get carried along if you stand on one, but maybe we can use it to our advantage. We we were supposed to do this it. one first. Let's get to work. We went too ahead. Yeah. <laughs> you spoiled yourself? Yeah. The thing about puzzles, puzzles are hard to... Uh, I don't know what the word I'm looking for is. But to evaluate its difficulty, you know? Some things just jump off the page, and you're like, oh, Eureka. And sometimes there's just one little thing you don't see, and it could just take you forever, you know? It's just how puzzles are. There is no fairness when it comes to puzzles. Alright, well, it's obvious we need to use the treadmill for a lot of things here. Seven lifts? What's the red object? What is it? 
Can you guys read that? Danger? Some high voltage item. It's kind of interesting. Alright, so... Um... One, two... I'm just so traumatized from the cranes. I could just focus on the boxes. Alright, so how do we get access to this TP? The wooden crate is kind of odd. We need to get access to this left area as fast as possible. Building a bridge around, I don't think we'll do anything. But also grab this green one from back here too. Another issue is when we start moving these big uh, steel ones. It's gonna stop us from grabbing the other crates too. Like we gotta get this this shit out of the way. Right? Well, let's just start by moving this and just see what happens. Right? Let's begin our journey. Four lifts. I think already by this point we can't even do it. Can't manually move it. We can't do the treadmill trick. The high level shit. It's not good, guys. We're having troubles on the uh, level one here. Not good. this wooden crate be useful? Like if I block this, will that help me in any way? I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I was just thinking that too, Joe. It, it it did teach you you can use the treadmill for the movement itself. That's kind of awesome, though, that we skipped it, because then it made the the other puzzle that much more exciting when I figured it out, right? So I, I'm I'm okay with that. What's in this container anyway? It's kind of cool, it's like an unknown item. Is that the next level of shit it wants me to do? 
Oh my god, it is. I I did I made the bridge by accident. That's pretty tricky. That's the last container. Puzzle god. It didn't want you to use the treadmill at the very end. Tries to fool you. I think if you hit the treadmill, you still be able to do it though, but. Alright. Yeah, that other the crane one is definitely the harder puzzles. I can tell. Just by like look the maps are so much more condensed, right? Less combinations and things. So this looks like we got a real bridge too. We got one wooden crate down there. There's, the treadmill's going the other way, so it's like super obvious it wants me to uh, to make a bridge here. I can make a bridge with this, these two guys, or that one back there. I don't know which one would be better. We got eight lifts for this. That wooden crate probably needs to come into play too. Like if I make the bridge here, then I still gotta move this guy out of the way. So no matter what, it's three turns. Well, let's see what happens. Or no. Yeah, I did do it wrong. Do it this way. Or no. Yeah, maybe. So I can take it to the treadmill, maybe? I don't know. Let's roll with this and we'll see at the end. Realize. step. One step off. By the way, if you looked at the hint in the crane level, the sir boss would have just said, I don't know. Which, which level in the crane level are all of them? Are you gonna go pro now that one million is on the line? No. <laughs> but it's it's awesome news and it benefits everyone, right? More tournaments to cover and and more competition. It's just it's just good news for everyone. And it's more than just the first prize too, guys. It's it's the it's the prize pool altogether. At least one of those like that, that's awesome. There's no downside for getting the hint. Except for pride, right? One, two, three, four. I don't think we're supposed to. Supposed to. I don't know if there's another way to bring that guy back. Right? Because you, no matter what, if I grab this guy, it's not enough steps, right? Unless the bridge was... no.
Yeah, of course, everyone's got a chance to win first place. What if I grab this guy? I just have enough. Right. But I don't understand that the one on the bottom kind of tells you that you got to do this a different way. Some you gotta bring from the top, some you gotta... Like this TV up here definitely need to bring, make a bridge. The shortest bridge is still... Still need to do it in three moves here. Or no, you can go this way too. Do it this way. And that's, that clears two sides. So that'd be more efficient. I think that's what one's supposed to do, at the very least, then. There's no way I can bring this this TV from that side without looking at this bridge. Four moves. And three crates. And I can't get this? Let's see here. I'm off by one move. Is there any way I can make this more efficient? If I took the wooden crate... Is there a way I can make this more efficient? Is there a way to make this more efficient? By one move. What if I moved it right here? Would this make it more efficient? Or it'd be the same thing? still the same thing. That wooden crate is the key, though, to, to getting that one move back. I can also make the bridge with this one, but then that crate is getting... Yo, what's up, Sonic? <laughs> DNF is dead! <laughs> I can't believe they did not... Sonic, did you watch that shit live? I need to see your live reaction of them not saying DNF. You better have a fucking reaction video of that. <laughs> that sucks, dude. I'm sorry, I'm sorry for laughing, but Jesus Christ, dude. That's so ridiculous. <laughs> Marvel 3 instead, though. You, ex you expected it, really? Fuck, maybe they didn't cut any deals. That's fucking wild, though. DN DNF and uh, Marvel vs. Capcom Inf Infinite. Two games that never saw an evil. It's fucking crazy. I'm not laughing at the at the misery because I'll be a hypocrite. It's just, it's just that's wild, dude. That like that's crazy. <laughs> it's just wild. I don't I don't know how else to say it. Can this wooden crate be useful to us? Where can I put it to make it really good? If I went this way, 
Maybe the, the wooden crates are red here, but I don't think I can get that last TV box back. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Let's see if I can. I do overthink things. No, I can't grab it. One off. Oh, never mind. I was overthinking it. Puzzle God. That's the last container. <clears throat> All right, let's go to the next dock. Did the character come out? Uh, the new character come out for DNF? Best bro, are you gonna stream yourself becoming a whale in Street Fighter Duel? I don't play mobile games, dude. I don't got time for that shit. I only got time for JRPGs, bro. If I'm gonna grind a game, it's gonna be fucking Apex. But it's Street Fighter. Oh. You're trying to convince me to play Duel, and your best pitch is that it's a front based off of a fighting game? Do I look like a fighting game streamer to you? The DLC is not out yet. Well, at least now, uh, Sonic, look on the bright side. Now you have your priorities straight. <laughs> you got your priorities straight and... And you actually have a game to look forward to that you know is not going to leave you in the dust. You know? Mr. Ryu won't let you down. <laughs> he won't lead you to the dust. You're going back to your roots. The only thing that's missing is Nash. <laughs> you don't have Nash. If only you had Nash, then it'd be perfect. <laughs> no Nash, no poison. Dude. And Nash is like literally dead now. You're gonna you're gonna have to find a a new character. Well, I guess you like yeah. You said you were interested in playing Manal. Let's we'll see how good she is. How many moves do I have? Eight for this shit? These treadmills are like all over the place. What the hell's going on? Do I have enough? This is this is ten steps away. Oh yeah, it's more. Than this. Did you enjoy Capcom Cup, Sonic? It was my favorite Capcom Cup. I really, I really enjoyed it. You liked it? Yeah, I liked it too. Okay, I'm going to waste two steps here. in the water and go down here Dago must have been full of salt with meta I thought Tokido would be full of salt but uh, Tokido interviewed him <laughs> that's what Tokido was doing all week because he was stuck there for a week right because he booked hotels and, uh, because <laughs> he thought he was going to win the LCQ, probably. And he just interviewed all the players. So I can't wait to check out those videos, because uh, Tokido usually... He gets a translation, like the CCs up for uh, YouTube. So I can't wait to uh, read that shit. Tokido's got some cool YouTube videos. There's this one really good thing. He does a big breakdown on Hitbox and stuff. It's good. Interesting shit. He, he translated the ending walker one already? Yeah, I'll definitely have to check that out. Mmm, 
I think I see the trick to this one. The trick to this one is blocking this treadmill so I don't fall to the right. I think that's the big brain part of this one. Yeah. Oh, I can't get my my high voltage one. Oh, what? We're going the other way on this one? Oh, what's going on here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, this one's a mess. What the hell is going on here? What happens if I grab this and like this? Hmm. Let me start this one. The buttons he used? What are you, what are you talking about, Sonic? Yo, I'll be right back. One sec. I restarted, right? Yeah, I did. Oh, that Cherry MX Low prof Profile Buzz Tokyo use? Oh, okay, cool. Wait, wait. I'm confused. You, you grabbed a, a hitbox finally? Oh, you're just for joystick. Okay. efficiently. There's no way to block this one going right. But do I... Is it still 10 turns? I need to find out, I guess. How many turns off is it? This one looks simple, but it's not. This one's tricky. Oh, I think I know one one thing we could do on the top there.
Uh, well, what, what are we talking about now? I'm lost in your guys' conversation. Wait, what's odd? What's what's wrong? I don't understand. What's this top six, top eight thing you're talking about? I'm lost there. I haven't seen this videos on buttons that I have box of buttons in my garage. Which one's talking about? I use gamer finger buttons with cherry silver in my. Uh, well, there's certain. Well, now they're using the cherry MX switches from for from keyboards for the actual switches now for the buttons. I haven't used gamer finger myself. But they, I don't, some buttons have their own self-proprietary switches. You probably want to use the ones that are real, like, you know, MX switches. There's tons of brands for, for keyboard switches these days. But MX Cherry is, like, the most, it's the OG. It's one of the re, it's one of, like, the, the oldest switches. But there's tons. And then there's, there's also, uh... Uh, personal colors that company makes like Razer has browns for example you know uh, Akko keyboards have uh, pinks and and so on right at the at the end of the day what you need to understand is force right how many grams of force it takes and what kind of switch is it is it a linear switch, right? Or uh, a click switch, or uh, what's the other one? A click or a clack, basically, or linear. Tactile, thanks, that's what I was looking for, tactile. If you do not understand the differences between those words or the feel of the actuation force, then it's gonna be hard for you to know what is best, right? But at the end of the day, it's all preference, right? It's all preference. So the more force you press the button, the better it's gonna to be to give you that feel of control. Because remember when I was using Snackbox, I went to one extreme, right? I, I, I used the most sensitive buttons. The, I don't even know what switches they were. There were light blues, I think. I think they changed them to pinks. But I went from... Uh, Songwa buttons take about 40 to 45 grams of force. And the buttons I got were 20 grams. That's as, as light as they can be. And I found that when I made them insanely light, they were good for like, you know, pressing buttons, but anything where I had to press buttons in succession, it felt mushy. Like, doing a double core circle forward with really light buttons, to me, feels mushy. Because you're you're not getting that good feel of pressing the button down hard, right? That's that's why, like, I talked to you guys about this millions of times, but the, the keyboard, like the fastest typers in the world, like the world records, they're all people using blue switches, which requires the most amount of force. And they're the loudest fucking keys, right? The reason that is, is because when you're typing at crazy speeds, because the keys are so heavy, you can feel each individual key in your brain, right? So it's like, it's not mushy at all. So you know exactly when to press the next key. It doesn't necessarily translate to fighting games, but it can for like motions and stuff right so it's uh there's a lot like there's a lot to it it's 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 gonna come down to preference there's no like ultimate setup but if tokido uses mx reds which he does and he wins majors you can be like oh well i know it's proven to work right what the fuck was i doing again oh yeah here's here's my thing i'm gonna try to do here Okay, what if I go like this? I grab this and I put it down. And then I grab this. And then I move out of the way. <laughs> it does nothing. It screws me over. That's what it does. I was trying to like big brain that shit. Okay. 
These wooden crates are the key. I think it wants me to make a bridge with the two wooden crates. That's the only way I want to get these bad boys over there. I'm pretty sure. I'm making the, the wooden bridge. It has translated to fighting games. The song was Snap Symphony of Marvel 3 Pool Area it used to uh, be like music to my ears. <laughs> I mean, I think it's fun when you have so many choices for controllers, you know? That's a cool, fun thing for video games, having your own personal instrument to play with, right? It becomes very personal. But it's also expensive, which is annoying too, you know? But you can use controller on fighting games, that's proven to work as well, so... I have to... I have to- oh wait, can I grab it this way? I can grab this way, but how does that help? It's just gonna move- oh, wait! That is the trick! <gasps> Big brain. Big brain, guys. Big brain. Is this enough? Do I need to block this one treadmill here? Let's see. Nope. So this does need to be blocked. So I need to waste a turn doing that. The problem is, I don't want to have to move these crates twice. But I might have to. So this puts me to four. I don't think that's what it wants me to do, but this is just this is easy. If I can yeah, see now I'm out of turns. I need two wooden crates to make the bridge. is so confusing. There's so much shit. So many combinations of things I can do here. But I like the idea of building a bridge here. But there's only a way I can get that one crate though. But no, I didn't get my electrical thing. Wait, I can't restart it? That's the last of the no, it won't let me restart it! No! Oh, we do. Okay. Oh. My life flashed before my eyes. I was, I was like, I was about to do something extreme. Like I was about to load the save file. I was. No, that's unacceptable. I would never concede on the puzzle notes. God, I almost fucking lost it there.
can we do? How can we use this efficient? Can't. All I can do is block the way. There's no other way to put this. Oh, we still can't do it. Man! This one's tricky. How do we do this one? This one's so next level. The funny part is how much harder it becomes when you uh, attempt to do it and, and collect the extra item. Now there's no way to bring this one up, right? No, there's no way. It's not happening. I'm almost certain, at the very least, this is where we're supposed to be at. So we got five turns. And three. Two extra steps and two wooden crates. Surprisingly, that one is like the perfect amount of steps. Three steps, I need two. Is there a way I can grab... Do one step to grab all three? The only way is to put something... Oh! Oh, but we still... Or can we? Maybe. If I grab this one. But then it's... Oh wait, maybe. I think I got it. I think I got it. No, I thought I had it. It's going the other way. No! No! I thought I had it, guys. I thought I was so smart. God, this part is so tricky. Crate here. This this crate is fucking sus. Once again, I can't get this from this way. It's short by one turn. It's insane. Chris and Sopranos, what? You saw you're set on on, on Montesanti, Montesanti, dude. Are you fucking crazy? He's got crazy, crazy vices and addictions. There's no way that could be me. That's a serious accusation.
Oh! I think I figured it out. I think I figured it out. I figured out another algorithm. This one. This one. I f I f oh! I think I totally got it now. Hold on. I, I got it. I got it, guys. I figured it out. The light bulb went off. This one's fucking tricky. This one is fucking tricky. Alright guys, Puzzle God incoming. These two, these wooden crates, they're red herrings. They're red herrings. They try to... They play you. Again. Here's the key. Instead of grabbing this wooden crate to block it, you can block it this way. No! 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 I didn't even think about that. No! Wait, 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 no, no. Wait, wait, wait. We're still good. We're still good. We're still good. I can salvage this. Come on. Okay. Hold on. Fucking losing my mind here. Okay, wait, we're still good, I think. No, we're not. No, we're not, we're not good at all. Wait, wait. Bastard, dude. Maybe the wooden crates, maybe you do have to use them. Oh, let's work this out. Last one, man. No way, right? There's no way, nowhere I can take it. I can only grab it from this angle. Yeah, maybe, maybe I got on the wrong order. Maybe, yeah. I'm sure, I'm sure I figured it out. That that's the one it wants me to move. again we gotta make sure it wants us to do it in a very specific order so we can use the crate to funnel the other ones in this it pushes me over and then it blocks that way or I can grab that one the wooden crate but then I can't So maybe I use this top one and put it this way like this?
I don't know. Let's see if I can do it in that many steps. This is the same amount of steps. No, it is faster. So I used the, the wrong wooden crate. crate was the red herring all along oh shit here we go yes puzzle god undefeated They should have made this entire game a puzzle game. It would have been sick. So what it was in those high voltage like crates, is it gonna tell me? Electrics electronics container. The electronics containers we got for an extra 105,000. Huh? And we got juice. GameCubes? Yeah? <laughs> 